The pencil update has released in Toilet Tower Defense. And there's tons of new units. Including the Summoner Pencil Man, the newest exclusive unit. All right, fine. Let's see how this thing does in the newest map. Pencil World! Yeah, baby girl, let's do this. Woohoo! All right, Pip, here we are in Pencil World. And what the Sigma is this map? And what the heck? What is this? Bro, what in the world is this Pencil World? This is crazy. Why is everything made out of the color white? Yeah, and also, why has everything got a man face on it, bro? Like, what even is that? That looks so weird, bro. I'm gonna zoom in on this. Uh, guys, tell me down below in the comments what you think of this update already. No, that's Doodle from Doodle and Arky. The guy with the man face and the yellow body. Wait, huh? what? For real? Oh, wait, you're kind of right, bro. Arky does kind of have a pointy head and a man face. That kind of looks exactly like him. So is this the Doodle and Arky world? Uh, maybe. I mean, it's the pencil event, so I guess you could call it the Doodle event in a way. But I know that this Ominar Pencil Man is way cooler than this map. Just look at this. It has such fancy shirt designs. Oh my goodness. This looks beautiful. But that price tag sure doesn't look beautiful. $1,500 to place it down. Bro, 1.5k racks. I'm not buying that thing, bro. You can buy it. I'm not buying well, it. Well, I'll probably buy it in about 5 to 10 business days. But first, I'm going to put down my Santa so I can actually purchase it. All right. Sounds good, buddy. I'm going to put my Santas down as well. Don't worry about us losing. I already have a green laser handling business right now. I'm not exactly sure if this Seminar Pencilman will be good because he only has a cooldown of one and he doesn't have any special abilities like AoE or piercing. So, uh, only we do you think this is going to be good? Oh, Pip, I think it'll be great. L let's think here. Okay, it's the Summoner Pencilman. So, it's probably going to summon. So, it's probably going to summon some pencil units that walk back here and it's over health. What does it say on its stats, Pip? Well, it says damage, range, cooldown, and 100,000 DPS. 100,000 DPS? Wait a second. If it says it does damage, then is it really a summoner unit? I don't know. Normally, I would put my summoners back here, but just in case, I think I'm going to put him right about here in just a moment once we auto skip and bada bing, bada boom. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the Summoner Pencilman. All right, let's see this bad boy. And, uh, Pip, what the oh. heck is this, bro? What is this thing in front of him? What What even is that? I don't know, bro, but it looks really good. Wait a second. That's a cannon. Wait, is he blasting them with a cannon? Oh. It's literally doing splash damage as we speak. But, uh, Pip, we, we might, uh, have a little problem here. Oh, uh, there's some toilets. There's some toilets. Oh, don't worry. My summoner pencil man should be able to handle them. Come on, summoner pencil what? man. Attack. From all the way over there, Pip, that thing has doo-doo rain. Oh. What is that? Come on, I'll be able to upgrade it soon. I just need about $6,000. Yeah, well, you might have to hurry, buddy. I don't think I got that long in my life right now. I'm going to die to this boss toilet unless you help me. Sounds like a personal problem. Uh, yeah, it is a personal problem, but it's also your personal problem too, Pip. If this toilet gets to the end, we both die. But ugh, I killed it with my green laser. It doesn't even matter. Yeah, what are you doing complaining about? You can just kill the toilets yourself. Dad, wait for my summoner pen. You. Pip, it's not as easy as it sounds, bro. Look! Your summoner pencil man didn't even kill these toilets. I might not have killed these toilets, but I got rid of like 80% of their health. So, frankly, if it weren't for me, we would have already lost by now. Well, I don't know about you, Pip, but uh, I think we're gonna lose right now if you don't start helping me. We're in a real pickle. I think this I think this pencil event is actually kind of difficult. No, it's easy. You just have to be good at the which I know you are. Uh, excuse me. I am literally the best at this game. As you can see, I'm carrying us both to victory right now. And when we complete this map, we're gonna get pencils that we can use to unlock pencil crates. Which means we can get the new godly pencil woman. Papa Queen. I can't wait to get that little camera woman. Uh, not a camera woman, Pip. Pencil woman, actually. Oh, same difference. No, it's not. Anyways, guys, I am looking at this summoner pencil man right now, and this guy is doing kind of doo-doo. Pip, when you can upgrade this thing, let me know, because I want to see what he does next. Maybe he just spawns in a different weapon every time he gets upgraded. Just you wait. When I get $6,000, it will add 15,000 
damage to this man. Oh, yeah. Well, I think we're going to need that 15,000 damage pit because we are definitely struggling right now. We're not struggling. Look, your summoner's little scientist clockmen are going to kill these dudes, right? Uh, it depends how you look at it, Pip. This guy only stops 3,000 damage. Unless my green laser just, like, starts, like, packing some punches, then, uh, oh, yep, we're fine. And now we have the vacuum toilet. Come on, summoner pencil man, dude. No damage to it, bro. What? Yeah, bro, you need to start helping me out, Pip. Start oh. helping out with the chores around the house, bro. Okay, fine. I guess I can put down a little mewing TV, man, but I'm not sure if this guy's supposed to help. Uh, well, anything will help at this point, Pip. We have boss toilets right over here next to my green laser. And uh, you're not really helping me very much. I I'm destroying huh? this vacuum toilet with my Mewing TV man. My Mewing TV man better not be better than the Summoner Pencil man. All right, that's it, bro. You're not helping me. I need to put down my future large clock man. Just go ahead and delete that future large clock man. We won't need it. Uh, I think we will, buddy, because look, it's actually killing these toilets. Unlike whatever your little Summoner guy's doing, he's slacking and sleeping. Well, no, it's not his fault. See, you look, normal units have this health bar above them, but they forgot to add a health bar above the summoner pencil man so he just falls asleep instantly that's unfair yeah pip i don't think evan forgot to add uh any health to this guy i think he just doesn't have any health in the first place he's literally just that voodoo garbage Skip a wave and now upgrade to level two now bazinga is this guy killing these mutant toilets in uh huh? okay uh, are you gonna kill him? Well, he is doing some damage. I can see some of these toilets taking some splash over here. So he is actually doing about 20,000 damage, but Bruh. that's every two seconds, Bib. This is doo doo. Uh, upgrade him again. I can upgrade him. My next upgrade is going to make him do uh, a damage every one second. Bro, Bruh. are you kidding me? My, my future large clock man literally does more damage than your summoner pencil man. Well, surely the future large clock man it has a negative to some aspect by this summoner pencil man. Like, uh, does your little future large clock man have a PP cannon? Uh, no, he does not have a PP cannon, but what he does have is a very strong fist, bro. No, no one cares about the future large clock man. That's why nobody uses him. Uh, buddy, the literal strategy to get on the top of the endless mode leaderboard is to use the golden future large clock Just man. Just wait till they add a golden summoner pencil man. That would literally be the best unit in the game. A golden Summoner Pencil Man, did you just say, bro? They are not gonna add that. You know why? Because they don't care about you, Pip. They're not gonna add this thing. Wait, so we're already about halfway to opening up a pencil crate. We're going to get that pencil woman now. Yeah, we are about to get that pencil woman. But before we go doing that, Pip, how about we tell the viewers about today's giveaway? Guys, we are giving away a free Summoner Pencil Man to a random person who subscribes to my channel, likes this video, and comments down below why you want it. And don't forget to put your username because we'll be sending it through the post office. I'm looking around this map right now and this is actually kind of cool. I mean, look at this. There's literally a lake of ink all around. And, oh, no, Pip. I, I, I kind of just fell. Uh, I can't get back. Help! Help! Lily, where did you go? Help! I fell in the ink! I fell in the ink! Lily, what are you doing? I'm trying to get back! A uh, bit. Our units have fallen asleep. Hold on. Hold down the line for me. Don't worry. While you're getting the milk, I'm going to hold down the fort. Uh, while well, I'm getting the what? You know what, Pip? I'm just going to reset my character. All right, I'm back now. But that was a little bit inconvenient. Stop being inconvenient, Louie, and start being good at the game. Don't worry, Pip. I'm doing it right now. As you can see, this giant blind toilet is not going to survive more than five more seconds because my future large clock man is going to punch his face off. Okay, yeah, finally you killed him. Now we are about half way to beating this mode. Uh, not actually, Pip. We have one more wave left to go. Actually. Oh, okay, math genius. Just because I didn't pay attention in math class doesn't mean you're smarter than me. Uh, well, uh, yes, it does. And Pip, about attention, maybe you should start paying attention in toilet tire defense. Bro, I'm still yet to see the third level of this summoner pencil man. I want to see what he does. And I've yet to see $12,000 in my bank account, Louie, unless you have $12,000 to spend. Uh, well, Pip, the thing is, I have 7,000. Oh, actually, 8,000 to spare. How have you got less money than me, bro? I thought you were saving up. Well, don't worry, Louie. I don't have to keep it in mind for long because guess who's about to upgrade their summoner pencil man to level three? 
Uh, you, please? Yep, and now it's time to uh, upgrade him. Uh, okay, what did that do, Pip? Uh, it, bro, it didn't do anything. Look at this. He still shoots the cannon, but he has a sword now. But the range on it is too do. It only attacks toilets that are here. Oh, no, he has a further range. He can hit toilets all the way out here. Yeah, with his cannon that does doo-doo damage. Look, it does 40,000 damage max, bro. But that sword also does 40,000. Hey, I wanted to use that. Don't worry, Louie. I'll just move him. See, let me go ahead and oh. Now I'll put him over here. Pip, I can't believe you just did that, bro. He, he, he's back to being useless. Upgrade him. Well, I did. Look, I spent all of my money, so now he can actually hit the toilets with his little samurai sword. All right, perfect. Now look at that damage, Pip. That is beautiful. Just what I wanted to see today. Bro, he's doing so much damage with his sword. You might as well just sell all your other units because we won't be needing them today. Honestly, I completely agree with you on that one, Pip. But I can't just sell all my units. I'm still going to help you out with my future large clock, man. Since I do need somewhere to put all the money I'm getting for my Santas and scientist clock, man. Nope, you should put all of your money in a traditional Roth IRA and save for retirement. Oh, huh? what now? Uh, Pip, I don't know what that means. Uh, you might be a little smarter than me when it comes to investing. Yeah, it's what all the old people say. They use big words. But anyways, Pip, we need to start getting through these waves, bro. We're on waves. 28 and we need to get to wave 40 if we want any pencils from this event you don't even have to worry see look i have two fully maxed out summoner pencil men right in front of the spawn and they're basically just spawn camping these toilets yep i mean you're kind of right with that one pip i'm looking at these toilets and they are taking a beating not to mention my future large clock man is slowing them down a bunch so you can do a ton more damage so Louie, are you jealous that i have this summoner pencil man and you guys uh, yes, but no, because Pip, this thing is expensive, and I don't really want to, uh, go broke. Okay, Brokey, well, I am putting down as many Summoner Pencil Man as I can. We're going to have an army down here. All right, that sounds good, Pip, and oh my gosh, the cavalry is here, bro. They all have cannons. What is this, the 16th century? Yep, doctor's orders. The more Summoner Pencil Man, the better. Oh my gosh, but Pip... We literally have a wave 30 boss, but oh my gosh, that makes me think really quickly. What is the wave 40 boss going to look Probably like? Probably a piece of poop because there's no way it's getting past this wall of summer pencil man. <laughs> A piece of poop. Okay, Pip. Well, I honestly think it's going to be like uh, like a pencil. It's going to be a big walking pencil, and it's going to have big teeth, and it's going to try and eat your face off, Pip. No, I know exactly what this boss is going to look like. It is going to be a giant <clears throat> talantric. A giant talantric. Why would it be a giant talantric, Pip? Explain. Well, because this is the pencil mode, and talantric loves using pencils. He built this map after all. Um, I, I don't know where your logic is in that, Pip. Uh, technically, if you think about it this way, I'm a partner, and uh, partners love to use pencils to sign units, so uh, it's probably going to be a big me that comes out at the end. I would be very scared if a giant Louie just popped through that toilet. But, Pip, I just put down my boss toilet so that we can deal with whatever boss comes out of this little tiny hole here. Bro, wait a minute. How are these big toilets coming out of that tiny little hole there? That, that doesn't even uh, align with the laws of physics. Don't pay attention to the laws of physics. Just let it happen. We let us beat these last five waves. All right. Sounds good, buddy. Okay, Pip. We are on wave uh, 36. We have four waves to go until the final boss. And I'm so... Uh, I don't know. I'm kind of scared. And I'm also kind of excited to see what it is. There's nothing to be scared about, Louie. Because after all, it's the final countdown. <laughs> Okay, Pip, 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 that's copyright. That's copyright. Oh, who cares if it's copyright, Louie? What's the worst that could happen? Uh, YouTube takes all of our money away, and we go broke for the rest of our lives. Oh, well, I would never go broke, but you, my friend, are going to stay broke. <laughs> Bro, I'm not going to stay broke. Literally, I have more money in the game than you. I have $21,000, and you have 11000 That's kind of sad. Well, you only have that much because you aren't actually even using your money. You're just a waste this space in this game right now. Yeah, I do. I use my money. I use my money. I'm gonna upgrade my boss toilet to level four in a minute. Okay, well, get your money up, not your funny up, boy, because we only have two more waves. 
Two more waves, and uh, I'm so ready for this boss to be like the Easter event and have like 30 million health. Oh, let's see. One more wave. Chat, W or L in the chat for the boss. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be an L, Pit, because most of these toilets coming out of the spawn right now have like no health, bro. This event is going to be like the easiest one known to mankind. All right, let's see what happens here. We are 75% of the way through wave 39, and as soon as we kill this dual cargo toilet, I'm pretty sure it will spawn. Oh, this toilet does have a lot of health, though a single toilet hasn't even got past here recently, but let's see. We're on the last wave. Oh, boy. All right, let's see what this thing is. Okay, infected Titan Speaker Man. I've seen plenty of these things. Come on, boss. Where are you at? Where are uh, you? Infected Titan Speaker Man. No, I don't want to know. And, bro, what is this thing? Wait, Pencil is, Mech. Is that the boss? Is that, is that the boss? Why is he so small? What, what is this thing? Are you kidding me, bro? This is the boss that, like, I don't even want to know. I thought there would be a boss health bar at the top of the screen, but apparently there's not. And this guy is already through <laughs> dead. Bro, I thought that thing would be, like, huge. What even was that? Pip, I'm pretty sure this was not supposed to pop up. Look at what the map <laughs> is called. Here's huh? your reward. LOL. That is definitely Evan giving us the reward, finally. I'm pretty sure it's called Pencil Map. Not here's your reward. But anyways, let's go open up a pencil crate. All right, Pip, we're back in the lobby. Can we afford a pencil crate? That is the question. Let's find out. And, uh, are you kidding me right now, bro? We need 25 more pencils just to get a pencil man. Bro, this is actually doo-doo. How? Oh. We got scammed again. Okay, wait a minute, Pip. There has to be something we can do to get a pencil crate. Uh, say Skibbity Sigma inside of pencil mode. Okay, Pip, we're going to pencil mode. Put Skibbity Sigma inside of pencil world. Uh, this is really weird to do, but okay. All right, Pip, I'm inside of doodle mode. Okay, let's put in a Skibbity Sigma. And boom, I think that should be it. Okay, now if I go back to the lobby, I should get my reward and be able to unlock a crate. And oh my gosh, that splash screen is beautiful. All right, here we go. And okay, there we go. I did the quest. Okay, let's claim that. And all right, Pip. Perfect. Now I can get myself a pencil crate. Let's just buy this fella. And all right, Pip. I'm going to sign this pencil crate. And hopefully this thing is going to be worth a fortune when I unlock it. I hope you do. Come on. I also have my own pencil crate. Who's going to get the more rare unit? Well, let's find out, Pip. I'm going to unlock mine first. So I'm gonna put it all the way over here. All right, boom. I'm opening the crate. Okay, please be the godly. Please be the godly. And, oh, pencil bag. That's actually kind of good. Wait a second, what is that? I got an epic, bro. Oh, wait, that's actually kind of bad. Wait, how did you get the 10% pencil bag? Uh, I don't know, Pip, but I'm pretty sure this thing is a little doo-doo. I don't really want it. Oh, you're right. It is rare, but it's doo-doo. The only good unit in this pencil crate is that Titan Pencil Woman. And as of recording, there's only 13 of this in bro. Open up a pencil crate. Come on, big money, big money. I need this little godly. <laughs> Pencil yeah. man! No, 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 <laughs> bye, Louie, I quit! No, okay, babe, that is actually crazy. No, Louie, I don't care about your dumb pencil mix. I am retired from Toilet Catapins. I am now a dress for best YouTuber. Oh my gosh, well, whatever, Pip. We have played this brand new update and tested out some new units, and I got a way better unit than you in the crate. I'm going to be Toilet Tower Defense with every unit, from basic to ultimate. And guys, at the end, and I'm going to be using super OP units to beat wave 1000 in endless mode. But if I don't, then I have to give an ultimate unit away to the first person who watches this video all the way through and subscribes. All right, Louie. Are you ready to beat Toilet Tower Defense with every tier of units? Oh, of course I am, buddy. But look, the thing is, every single time we go into a game, we are only allowed to use units in the basic and then maybe the uncommon, then the rare. We're not allowed to use Santas at all until we get to mythic units, okay? All right, Louie, I don't even need a Santa. All right, well, my plan is to use this speaker man and this camera woman. These are the only two basic units in the whole game. And we are about to see how far they get in nightmare mode. And we are going to see what tiers of units can beat the nightmare mode. So come on, buddy. Let's go to Toilet City and see if these basic speaker man and camera women can beat nightmare mode. What are your predictions, Pip? Will we beat nightmare mode? Absolutely not. Yeah, 
Yeah, I thought so as well. Guys, comment down below if you've seen anyone ever beat Nightmare Mode with basic units. Because, trust me, I don't think you have. But anyways, let's do this then, Pip. Vote for Nightmare and let's see if any of our units can even beat any of these toilets that come out of the spawn. Spoiler alert. Yeah, most likely they won't. But we'll see about that, buddy. First of all, though, we have to probably put down some speaker man. And also some camera women. So let's do this. So first off the bat, I'm going to put down a camera woman. And then I'll put down a speaker man. And I'll put them down in the corners here to do the most damage possible. And I don't know about you, Pip, but these small toilets have more health than my camera man and my speaker man could even handle. Oh, come on. Why don't we just put down my speaker man and fully max upgrade him? All right, good stuff. Pip, but uh, I don't think you can afford to max upgrade him. We're kind of broke right now. Yeah, whoa. Is this what a noob feels like? Yeah, this is what it felt like when we started playing Toilet Tower Defense. Remember when we were noobs at this game? Oh, like five years ago? It's been so long. Yeah, but now we're partners, and we are insane at this game. But, uh-oh. Irregular yeah. toilets are spawning, and these things have way more health than our speaker men can handle. I think oh, it's safe to say we are cooked. No, no. There's no no way we die on wave three now, Louis. Uh, Pip, I think that is what's going to happen. We are probably going to die on, like, wave five. I'm predicting wave five is the furthest we can get. No, no, no. Just, uh, we just need to put our units together to make the strongest unit in the game. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't really know what that means. But we are not doing enough damage. Um, well, you want to know what it means? It means we have to get on our knees and pray. Yeah, I am. I'm on my knees right now. I'm hoping and praying right now that we can beat any of these toilets, but I really don't think we can, Pip. Yes, we can. Just turn on auto skip. Uh, auto skip? Uh, you know what? I'm trusting you, Pip, but we're on wave five, and this is the exact wave that I said we would die on. I just know <laughs> this is about to happen. Oh, no, 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 but luckily these toilets don't even do that much health, right? Mm, I would disagree, Pip. I beg to differ. I think we're probably going to die to these little toilets here. Oh, no. Just kill as many as you can. I'm trying. We're on wave six. And wait, my speaker man is actually kind of holding down the fort right now. But oh, never mind. No, it's not. Not anymore. I hope your speaker man can do something, Pip. Upgrade them. I am. I'm upgrading them as fast as I can. Yeah, me too. I'm doing the best that I can. But Pip, I'm going to be honest. I think we did not last very long. We pretty much only lasted until wave seven, which is kind of embarrassing. No, no, Louis. Think about it. We still have time. We still have time. Uh, I don't think we do, Pip. My speaker man is doing 100 damage a hit, but um, all the toilets just got past him. And now, I think we're cooked. Yep, yeah, it's over. Come on, Louis. We just put down a green laser. I don't have any. Oh, my gosh. We're dead. Rest in peace. But anyways, Pip, uh, that was as far as we could get through that. But anyways, now we have to use uncommon units. All right, Louis. We just lost lost the common match, but now it's time for the uncommon match. So we're going to be using units like the car speaker man and the cameraman, and maybe I can even equip some common units, right, Louis? Yeah, sounds like a good idea, buddy. I'm equipping some uncommon units right now. You just can't find me because I'm uh, hiding in the marketplace. Uh, okay, Louis. Well, stop hiding. We have a game to play. Well, I need to buy some uncommons. I, uh, for some reason don't have them, so I'm actually just in the market buying some. Well, Louis, get over here, right? Right now, where I'm going to do an uncommon game all by myself. What? Uh, fine. Just let me buy one more uncommon unit, then I can come back. Let's see here. Uncommons. Okay, this is good. I'm going to buy a scary speaker man, a sneaky speaker man, and then also a large heart speaker man. This is pretty good. I am literally spending so many gems right now. So, guys, make sure to subscribe because I'm going broke after this video. And there we go. I just bought a bunch of them. Let me just get back to the lobby now and let's go. All right, Pip. I've got a bunch of uncommon units now. I have got myself a nice large heart, a scary speaker man, sneaky speaker man, lucky speaker man, and I'm going to go with the uh, regular cameraman. All right, I think I'm ready. Do you want to go to Palm Paradise and see how far we can get in nightmare mode? Let's get it started tonight. Yeah! Anyways, now we are in Palm Paradise, and we are going to see just how good our uncommon units are. Pip, what is your predictions for this game mode? Uh -huh. I'm predicting we get a W. I'm predicting we get to wave, uh, I don't know. I'm thinking wave, I, I really don't know, Pip. This is a difficult one to think about. Come on, Louie, just throw out a number. It's not that hard. Uh, I 
I think wave 10. Wave 10 or wave 11, maybe. I mean, look, we have these lucky speaker men, and this guy is doing the Irish jig right now. So there's no way we lose. Oh, uh, well, I'm predicting wave 2000. Wave 2000? Are you sure? Well, yeah, Louis, we, we can do anything we put our minds to, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure. You know what? I'll go ahead and put down a scary speaker man when I get enough money. And then we should be able to do a nice little bit of damage to some of these toilets coming out of the spawn. Anything else that gets through will die to my lucky speaker man. So we're looking good, Pippin. Uh, wait, what's going on? Why is my unit not killing all of these toilets? What's going on here? What do you mean, Louis? It is killing the toilet. Well, my lucky speaker man was like giving up for a second there. He wasn't even doing anything. Oh, I don't believe you. Uh, well, you should, buddy. It was crazy. You should have seen it wasn't doing anything. Sounds like a personal problem. Uh, no, buddy. It's not a personal problem. But you know what is a personal problem? The fact that some of these toilets are getting through and we're doing nothing to stop them. Oh, then come on. Just uh, do some more damage. Yeah, I'm going to be honest with you, buddy. The only uncommon unit I can think of using is this lucky speaker, man. It's one. Of, it's the best uncommon in the game. It does 300 DPS off the bat and it's way better than the scary speaker, man. Should this even be an uncommon unit. It is just actually way too overpowered. I'm going to be honest. It kind of feels more like an epic unit. It's actually that good with the damage it's doing. Oh, yeah. They should make this probably a cosmic. A cosmic? Bro, that's skibbity tower defense, not toilet tower defense. Oh, same thing. No, it's not, but I might need your help. There's a dual claw toilet. Watch out. What do you mean my help? Louis, you're the one with the best uncommon in the game. You're helping me. I forgot about that. But anyways, Pip, you know one thing that's good about this lucky speaker, man? Is that it's good? Uh, no. It has a healing range, too. Which means it can heal any of the units around it. Which is kind of good, considering that on Nightmare Mode, you have a lot of toilets that stun you. Oh, if it can heal toilets, can it heal a broken relationship? No, it, it cannot. It, it may be a lucky toilet, but it's not a lucky toilet like that. Oh, I miss my e uh... oh, Okay, Pip, I don't know what you're talking about, but I just upgraded my lucky speaker, man, to level level two. And now it's doing 1,000 DPS. That's actually OB. Oh, 1,000 DPS is crazy. Wait, it might actually kill the boss toilet. Yep, I'm going to be honest with you, Pip. I kind of feel like how I used to feel when I did the videos. When I used to do the videos as a noob, I was trash at this game. And it kind of feels like I'm going back to my uh, old roots of being bad at toilet tower defense. Oh, man. But we're already two times further than we were with the common units with the uncommon unit. Yep, that's because we're good at this game, buddy, but oh no. Uh, I'm going to be honest, I think we're struggling a little bit here. Oh, no such thing as struggling in the Pip household. Let's kill the boss toilet. All right, please do damage, do damage. And okay, there we go. But here comes the mutant toilet. This one is even worse. There has to be a unit that I can use that is easy to upgrade and does a lot of damage. Oh, big mama jamma, this mutant toilet is a bit difficult, like big chungus. Yeah, it is a bit difficult, but I'm pretty Pretty sure our lucky speaker man should be able to kill it. Let's just wait and see. Come on, and yes! That was easy! W's in the chat, guys! Yep, I'm telling you, I know that we can get to wave 10. I can almost feel it in my veins. Oh, if I had hands, I could definitely feel them in my hands right now. Yep, but look, buddy, this minigun toilet is about to die. It has 10,000 health, and this lucky speaker man is totally making us super lucky. We're getting past wave 10. I guarantee it. Oh, they should probably remove the lucky speaker man because we might get further with uncommon units than rare units. Yep. But we have to see about that, buddy. We're not sure just how far we are going to get just yet. Oh, well, I'm certain that we can beat at least half of Nightmare Mode. Guaranteed. Mm, are you sure? I'm not sure about that. I am absolutely positive. Just look how quickly we kill this jetpack police toilet. Um, Pip, I'm not sure about you, but it doesn't seem like we're going to kill it. It seems like it's going to get through. Uh, well, then that's your fault. Just 10,000 health left. How are we supposed to kill this thing? Oh, come on. Just get $10,000 from Mr. Beast. That should kill it. Uh, bro, I don't think Mr. Beast is willing to give me that much money. I think we're pretty much cooked. This jetpack police toilet is about to smack us in the face and kill us very quickly. Wait, well, are you broke or something, Louie? Put down more lucky speaker, man. Oh, I am broke. I 
I don't have any money. Oh, let me just put down the sneaky speaker, man. And yeah, he uh, he looks sneaky because he's not doing anything. He's sneaking around behind my back and doing no damage. You're just about as broke as a joke over here. I know, buddy. This is terrible. Uh, quit your crying. Its health is so low. You can kill it, right? Uh, I wish I could, but I'm probably not going to be able to. You know what? Let me put down another lucky speaker man right here. And hopefully we will be able to do enough damage to stop it. But Pip, we got further than I thought. We're on wave 11. Exactly, Louie. Stop trying to doubt us. Um, I'm still doubting us, buddy. I mean, look, this jetpack police toilet might actually make it through. Come on, and now! Come on, Pip. We have to stop it right now. Put units down. I have too many placed. I'm trying to stop it. I'm trying to stop it. Oh, come on. And yes. Oh my gosh, Pip. We might actually be able to get further in wave 11. I don't know, Louie. When it takes us three to five business days to kill one toilet, I'm not too confident. Oh, I'm very confident, buddy. You know what? I'm going to skip a wave. I'm that confident. I just need to get a bit more money and I can upgrade this lucky speaker man to be OP. But, oh no. Uh, Pip, I think we might have an issue. Uh, what is the issue? Help! Help! Come over here! We have a bus saw toilet! These things are OP! Oh no, they will be easy to defeat. Just watch! Bro, oh, um, we just took a lot of damage. We almost died, but I think we're okay. But look, I maxed out one of my lucky speaker men now. Hopefully this guy will be able to stop the toilets from advancing. Oh, come on. Oh, but these toilets are getting really difficult. This mutant toilet has, oh, 160,000 health. 100 and what now? 160! <laughs> Oh, Pip. Yeah, we're cooked. <laughs> we're cooked. Oh, no, no, no. We just have to believe. If you believe, you can accomplish anything. Buddy, I thought we had a chance, but really, not anymore. I don't think we have a chance very much now. This mutant toilet is totally going to take us out for a nice dinner in the Bahamas. Oh, should we just throw in the white flag now and surrender? Honestly, I think we should. I don't think we're going to last that long now. This parasite toilet is walking through. This mutant toilet is walking through. They're taking literally no damage anymore. You know, Louis, let's just try to get as far as we can. Start auto-skipping! All right, I'm auto-skipping, buddy. I don't know if that's going to help us or not, but we'll see. Let me just put this lucky speaker man right down here. I'll just move him, put him here, kill this guy, and I'll go ahead and put another one down. Come on! Yeah, we're not killing this mutant toilet, but we can get as many waves ahead as we can. If we just auto-skip, we might be able to get to wave 20 before we die. I don't know about wave 20, Louis. But whatever. Let's just see what we can do. I know. Go, 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 go. Um, you and Toilet, we can talk about this, right? I mean, you don't actually want to kill us. Uh, just, uh, can you, can you go the other way? Uh, buddy, I don't think he wants to. Look, he's literally looking directly at your face right now with that weird smile on his face. And if he could speak, he's probably going to sound like, uh -huh, I'm going to take out your brains. Oh, no. And wait, uh, 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 that airplane Toilet is going at lightning speed. Um, uh, yeah, what? that guy has more health than the mutant toilet. We're not killing this guy. Um, good luck. Uh, oh, no. Yeah, we're good. We are going to get to wave 20, hopefully, before we die, though. Mm, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, Ed. Yeah, we only got to wave 18. Oh, well, that is way more than the wave 3 we got last time. Yeah, definitely. But anyways, Pip, let's go back to the lobby, because now it's time to try out the rare units. All right, Pip, we're back in the lobby. And now it's time to put our rare units on. So I'm going to use the Pendulum Clockman, Ohio Cameraman, and look, we can finally use farms. I'm using a Speaker Woman's Rose Farm brown suit and uh or a bit of aoe i think i'll use the hmm which one's better i'll use the speaker helicopter oh well Louis, actually i'm going to use some better stuff i'll use the tv man the ohio cameraman the pendulum the car speaker man as well as the toxic upgraded titan cameraman bro um that's an exclusive there is no way we're using that oh fine Louis. i'll just use a dumb little cameraman instead let's go all right, this time, let's go to the desert. It seems like you picked the map this time. All right, Pip, go ahead. Vote Nightmare. I'm ready to see just how far we can get. And I think I have us a challenge. Maybe we should leave Auto Skip on and see how far we can get. Oh, that sounds like a perfect challenge, Louis. Let's do it. All right, I slapped Auto Skip on. And I think the first unit we need to put down is the Ohio Cameraman. All 
right, well, you can place down the Ohio cameraman, but me, I'm going to put, uh, what's my best unit? Probably my cameraman. All right, Pippin. Wait, that's an uncommon. Oh, my gosh, Pippin, are you kidding me? Well, it's super OP. Just look, it's doing 20 GPS. Pip, it's not that OP, trust me. But anyways, these Ohio cameramen are managing to hold off these toilets. But what we need to do next is something very important, buddy. We need to start upgrading, and I'm going to be honest, these guys are a pain to upgrade. Look at how much it costs! 5,000 bucks! Why are your Ohio cameramen even that OP in the first place? I do not know. They are very expensive, though, so I'm going to need to start putting down my farms. Pip, please carry me for the time being. Oh, well, yeah, but just look at my hotbar. The TV man costs $200, but does 40 DPS, when the Ohio cameraman costs $100 and does 200. Yep, this is just too OP. Pip, I think we're cooked. Trust me, I think we're cooked. There's no way we are winning this. Uh, yes, we are, Louie. I'm super confident. All right, well, I put down a pendulum clock, man. So hopefully that will be able to hold off a few toilets. But Pip, I am going to need your help. We are going to take a bit of a beating from this glasses toilet here. As long as we... Unless if we don't kill it. Oh, we are going to kill it, Louie. Stop being such a negative Nancy. Um, I am a very negative Nancy, but... Trust me, I'm always very, very negative. You guys just never see it on camera. Uh-huh, yeah, you're always negative. Probably because you're always losing. I'm not always losing. Well, I am losing in life, and I am losing in toilet tower defense, so you're kind of right, actually. Oh, oh, you don't have to be mad that your E-kitten left you. No! I know my E-kitten left me, but that's no reason for you to say that. That is very mean, but uh, there's a boss toilet coming, and it's very strong. This is not good. Well, Louis, it's not my my fault we're auto skipping. Pip, we might have to stop auto skipping right now. Uh, nah, I'm gonna do my own thing. Pip, stop auto skipping. We're gonna lose. Well, just put down more Ohio cameramen, then, buddy. Oh, these Ohio cameramen are doo doo. They're not doing anything. Are you sure about that? I'm very sure. Oh well, look, this mutant toilet's health is absolutely shredding. Who will kill it just fine? Only because I'm putting down pendulum clock, man. That was so close. Close. Easy! We came very close to taking a beating there, Pip. You know what? I'm going to start saving up to upgrade this pendulum clock, man. And then we'll start upgrading the Ohio's. But, um, we have a jetpack police toilet on the way, Pip. I might need your assistance. Oh, Louie, <laughs> why are you scared of a jetpack police toilet? I thought you were good at this game. I'm scared of it because it's actually getting very close to killing us right now. You might need to move some units back. Oh, I think I'll just put down some pedulium clock, man. Pedulium? Bro, it's called a pendulum clock. Oh, my gosh, Pip. You are so dumb. You're so dumb. It's annoying me. Oh, come on. Just kill the police toilet. Uh, Pip. I can't do it. Help. Come on. It's so close. Oh. We killed it. No, it killed us. We're taking damage now, buddy. Oh, well, at least it's gone now. Yeah, but here comes its next contender. The flying bus saw toilet. Ruh-roh. Ruh-roh, -ro. Ro -ro, Raggy. Uh, we're in a real pickle. Buddy, nah, we're dead. We're totally dead here. We have 50 health left, and we got to wave 13. How far did we get with the rare units? Uh, about wave 18 before with the uncommon units. There is no way. Wave 18 with the uncommon, and wave 13 with the rares. Pip, I don't even think I want to see this round. It's going to be too heartbreaking for me to see. We, it'll be fine. You know what they say. The game's not over till the fat lady sings. Till the who? What? You know what? Whatever, Pip. Pip, I have no idea what that meaning says, but what I do know is that we need to kill this mutant toilet before we get our butts handed to us. We have 50 health left. No, we'll be fine. Uh, no, I think we'll be dead, buddy, because look, here comes an airplane toilet, and yeah, we're cooked. How are the uncommon units better than the rare units. This makes no sense. Well, to be fair, we didn't auto-skip in the uncommon wave. Oh, yeah, good point. Uh, but you know what? Let's go back to the lobby because, buddy, we are going to use epic units next. Now, I think epic units will have a little bit more pizzazz to them. So let's just scroll down, find our epic units, and use them. So let's see. We have this Cuckoo Clock Man who does a lot of damage, this Microwave Man, uh, the Easter Speaker Man is kind of garbage, so I'm, go I'm not going to use that. And what else do we have? Reindeer Speaker Man, Rockets, and 
And then I can use this awesome pumpkin farmer. All right, Pip, so I picked my units. Now it's time for you to pick yours. All right, Louie, I got my epic pumpkin farmer. I'm ready to go. Bro, there's no way. You've got a bunch of splash units and AoE, and you still got an uncommon, but you know what? Fine, I'll carry you. Follow me. We are going to go to Cameraman HQ this time around. All right, Louie, I'm trusting you that Cameraman HQ will be easier. Uh, well, I didn't guarantee it will be easier. But we can try our best. Surely we'd have a better chance with this pumpkin farmer since I'm going to get my money up. Well, I don't know, buddy, but we better get trying. So I'm going to put my pumpkin farmer straight down. And uh, oh, wait, wait, Pip, did you put yours down? Yep. Yeah, we're broke. <laughs> we're, we're broke. There's literally a bunch of toilets coming through right now, Pip. I don't know if we're going to survive this. Louie, we'll be fine. Come on, just turn on auto skip, then we'll make some money, and I can put down my Ohio man. All right, we'll go ahead. Quick! Come on, Louie, stop your stressing. I am stressing very bad, Pip. I really don't want to lose. These epic units are worse than the rare units, and what is the point in even using them? I don't know, but this really tests the game's balancing system. So if the game is broken, we can just complain. <laughs> yeah, did you know I'm Evan is one of my best friends on Discord? So, uh, you know, I can actually change the game if I wanted to. Uh-huh. How could you change the game, Buster? Uh, well, did you know he actually lets me try out the updates before they come out? And did you know he also comes to me whenever he needs, um, coding help because I'm a coder? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Maybe you should code an e-girlfriend then. Uh, I'm not coding a girlfriend in the toilet tower defense. It's not that easy. Yep, buddy. Life ain't easy. I know it's not. Oh, whatever. Pip, just watch this. I'm going to put down my microwave man now, and he will help you out with his AOE magic. Wait. <gasps> microphone man. Oh, that seems pretty good, but honestly, your lucky speaking man seemed more OP. Uh, no, it's not. This microphone man does 250. Oh, wait, no, it does. Oh, wait, no, it does 500 AOE damage, which is actually pretty OP. Um, more like pretty trash. Um, no, it's not, because look, I just upgraded it, and now it's doing 1,200 damage in AoE. So, look, it's just blasting these dual claw toilets into the ground. Or should I say it's microwaving them? Mm. Uh, yeah, Louie, that wasn't funny. Um, oh, fine, okay, fine, whatever. Oh, but anyways, Pip, look, we are starting to take a little bit of damage. I might need your help. Oh, why would you need my help, Louie? I'm busy trying to farm over here. Because we're getting our booties beat. Look, these boss toilets are coming in. And they will do a nice big chunk of damage if they get through. Sorry, Louie. I can't hear you over my pumpkin farmers. Oh, well, whatever. While you're upgrading those, I'm upgrading my microwave man, who now does 4,000 damage in AoE. So he's hopefully going to be able to kill these really, really dangerous toilets. Oh, I really hope he does, Louie, because you're going to have to carry me. Yep, Pip, he is. He is. He's doing a good job now. I'm actually doing a nice big chunk of damage. I don't think we are going to fail as quick as we did in the last round. Oh, this game kind of feels like Clash of Clans because I am upgrading. Uh, more like Clash of Clans because you're clashing with my clan. Bro, you need to help me. You're just upgrading your pumpkin farmers while I'm losing over here. Farming is so relaxing. Yeah, only because you grew up on a farm. And here I am getting my butt handed to me because uh, you're literally letting these boss toilets through. Oh, well, if they're beating up your booty cheeks, maybe you just need to get some booty cheeks medicine. Bro, oh, I'm not getting booty cheeks medicine. Pip, I don't know about you, but I think you need the booty cheeks medicine. It's awfully crusty down there. Oh, no, I do use the booty cheek me medicine. How do you think I have such a guillot? Oh, it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm looking at your guillot right now, and you literally have a negative guillot. It's literally going inwards. Oh, well, you have negative riz, buster. Oh, well, I'm not worried about that. I don't care if I have negative riz. It doesn't even matter. Uh -huh, riz is the most important thing in the world. And you know what else is the most important thing in the world? Winning. So start winning. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm doing my best, Pip. And you're not really helping me very much. So uh, maybe you should help me. I mean, look, a mutant toilet is making its way through. I'm going to need to put down a microwave man to hold it off. Fine, Louie. I'll help you since you're really bad at the game. I'll do a little bit of charity work. Uh, Pip, charity work means like uh, helping me not die. And you're not doing a good job because I'm literally trying to carry you right now. This airplane toilet, it's getting through! Not my problem. Uh, yes, it is! Oh, my gosh. Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I think this airplane toilet is about to get through. This is not good. Here it goes. Oh, 
we just took a lot of damage. Oh, come on, Lou, come on. I just uh, put your heart into it. We can do it. I'm putting my heart and soul into this work, Pip, but it's uh, not seeming to go very well. You might have to upgrade some units for me. I'm busy trying to upgrade, Louie, but I'm not just Bezos over here. Neither am I, Pip. Who do you think I am? Uh, a nobody? Uh, yes, that, that that's actually kind of true, buddy. I'm literally a nobody because right now I'm having no effect on the game. You have all the money because you upgraded your pumpkin farmer. So do something. I am doing something. I'm putting down some Confederate Ohio cameraman to beat them. Pip, I have never seen this Ohio cameraman look like that. That is uh, new to me. Oh, yeah. Well, we, maybe if you paid attention to the game, you could see it. Uh, well, maybe, honestly, maybe I should have paid attention in history class, too. But, Pip, things are getting crazy. These toilets are starting to stun us. We are not able to really do that much damage anymore. You know what? I'll just put a microwave man down and hopefully I can max upgrade him and it can kill any toilets that get here. Come on, Louie. Put it into overdrive. I'm putting it into drive. Oh, well, it looks like you're putting it into break because you're breaking the game. Uh, no, I'm not. What, what do you mean I'm breaking the game? I'm doing just fine. Oh, well, we are on wave 23 right now, so we're doing pretty good. But it doesn't look like we'll be on wave 23 for a while. Because look, my units just fell asleep. Tell your Ohio cameraman to do something. Oh, well, I told them to do something, and they said, uh, nah, we're taking a nap. Bro, what? We got to wave 20. Oh, uh, well, that's pretty good, isn't it, Louie? But, oh, come on. Maybe the legendary units will be way better. All right, well, let's go back to the lobby then and put on some legendary units, and I already know which ones I'm going to use. All right, Pip, I'm going to unequip all of my units, and let's scroll down to the legendary ones. And the ones I'm going to use are as follows. The Leprechaun Cameraman. Then I'm going to be using the Cupid Camera Woman. Then I'm going to be using the Mewing TV Man. And then what else? Maybe the Classic Cameraman. That thing is kind of crazy. And then I'll go ahead and finish it off with a nice... Hmm, what do I want? Oh, I know. A Frosty DJ Speaker Man. All right, Louie, well, I have my units ready, and your boy's ready to go. All right, well, buddy, we have to go to a different map this time, so I'm going to Toilet Lab. Follow me. We're gonna get cooking in the lab. Oh, yes, we are, Pip. And here we are, and wait, this map looks a lot different now. Uh, what do you mean, Louie? This looks like the exact same. Uh, well, I remember the map did not look like this at one point. Oh, well, you must just not be paying attention. Yeah, honestly, I think you're right, but anyways, Pip, I'm going to put down my Cupid camera woman right now in order to stop these little toilets from getting through. Since she does piercing damage, she is pretty much very, very good for keeping the toilets away for the time being. While we upgrade our, oh, Fantas. Uh, we don't have any of those. Um, well, I have a pumpkin farmer. Uh, you know what? Uh, why do you have a pumpkin farmer, Pip? You have to use legendary units only. Uh, I don't care. Okay, you're, you're totally cheating. Come on, Louie. Let me just use this one pumpkin the farmer. I'll play by the rules a little bit. I'll just use one. All right, fine, but you better carry me since you have all the money. Oh, well, I don't have all the money in the world. I just have a little tiny, tiny pumpkin farmer. Sure. Okay, then, Pip. Well, we'll see what happens this way. Uh, as you can see, I'm saving a bunch of money, and all I need to do is just put down a really good unit. So, what do I want to do? Maybe a mewing TV man, or maybe I could put down this classic cameraman. This one is pretty good. Well, we you better get placing a little faster because these toilets are, in fact, getting through. Oh, no. Well, you know what? Fine. I'm going to have to put down another Cupid camera woman in order to stop them. Hopefully, this will be good enough while I save for my classic cameraman. Oh, Pip, are you kidding me? I need to be able to do more damage than this. Well, get your money up, man. Maybe put down a pumpkin farmer. Bro, you get your money up. You're the one who's literally not carrying me right now. You're supposed to be carrying. Oh, well, now I'm carrying. Look, I have a leprechaun. All right, well, good job. But now I'm going to put down the classic cameraman. He is going to use this little Roblox sword to smack any toilets that come through. He's going to kill them easy. Oh, yeah, he's going to kill them easy because of my leprechaun getting it to low damage. Bro, no way. Your leprechaun is not getting them to low health. Look, this guy has 26,000 health right now. But watch, when my classic cameraman kicks in, boom, 5,000, boom, 5,000. He's that strong. He's killing this boss toilet in about three hits. Am. Now he's dead. This classic cameraman is insane. I need to save up 1,600 bucks to be able to do any damage with it. Oh, man. If only you had a pumpkin farmer. 
Oh, well, you know what? Fine. How about this, then? I'll just have a mewing TV man. And it'll kill all of the little low health toilets to let my classic cameraman do more damage. And... Uh-oh. What is he doing? Why did he just turn around? Why is he looking at me menacingly? Did we just break the mewing toilet? I don't know, but Pip, he turned around and just looked at us. I think he might have heard what I said about killing him. Oh, he might have a crush on you. Uh, I hope not. Pip, I'm going to be completely honest with you right now. I need to upgrade my classic cameraman, but I am not getting anything to do that. I'm getting no money, and you're getting all the money. Yeah, Louie, it feels good being rich, doesn't it? Uh, Pip, yep. It feels good being rich, but it doesn't feel good being stuck in an acid pool. I just fell in a pool full of acid. Help! Sounds like a personal problem. Oh! Oh, Louis, get out of the acid and start playing the game, nincompoop. Oh, yeah! An, oh, my gosh. Why did you just call me a nincompoop, buddy? Oh, sorry. Was I not supposed to say that word? No, you're not allowed to call me a nincompoop. That's not allowed in this uh, game. Uh, uh, Evan told me to. All right, buddy, but I just upgraded my leprechaun to level two. Now he's doing like, oh, I don't know, 4,000 damage a second. Oh, yeah, well, I just upgraded my classic cameraman, and look at him. He's doing more damage than your little sucky unit could ever do. Oh, that is just simply not true, buddy. Your classic cameraman is trash, since the classics are always the worst. Are you sure? Your leprechaun is only doing, what, uh, 3,200 damage? My classic cameraman is doing 3,500 every 0 0.5 seconds. So that is, what, 6,000 DPS? Oh, no. I'm so scared of your little <laughs> trash unit over there. Oh, yeah. Well, how about this, buddy? I'll put down two leprechauns, and then your leprechaun won't be able to get any kills. Oh, fine. You can put down those leprechauns. I don't even want to put down things. Oh, well, you know what, Pip? How about this? We managed to get to the end of Nightmare Mode. I am pretty sure we can call it a day there. You know, Louie, we're doing pretty good right now, but I'm not sure if our little legendary units are going to help us get to the end of Nightmare Mode. Hey, have some faith, buddy. They can do this. And Oh, no, they can't. No, they can't. No, oh, no, no. Look how Why much... is this airplane toilet so fast? Yeah, and look how much health he has. There's no way we're going to beat it. Pip, upgrade that leprechaun right now. Oh, come on. I'm going to have to upgrade it and start praying. All right, let's see if we can do this, Ed. Okay, 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 okay. Nice. Just barely. Woo, that was close. That was that was too close, buddy. Never let it get that close again. Way too close to call. You know what, Pip? I think it's finally time I get this classic cameraman to level three. But I need to wait until these mutant toilets die so I can get the money to do it. So I'm just going to let this happen. Get some more kills like this. Kill these buzzsaw toilets. And I have to admit, this classic cameraman is actually better than I thought it would be. Oh, yeah, but come on. If it's better than you thought it would be, why are toilets still getting passed? Well, Pip, I gotta help that. I just have to wait. And oh, no, my classic cameraman just fell asleep. Oh, stop slacking and sleeping, Louie. I'm, I'm trying. Um, Pip, are you sure your leprechauns are doing a nice bit of damage there? Yep, they're doing about 10,000 damage each. Okay, that's good. It's more damage than my classic cameraman is doing. But next time I upgrade him, boom! He's doing 15,000 DPS, which is more than yours. And look, he's even throwing this little dodgeball. And it's doing a surprisingly high amount of damage. And whoa, what just happened? Did you just hear an explosion? Uh, no, Louie, I'm deaf. I don't know how to hear. Well, I'll be honest, Pip. I just heard an explosion go off because of the classic cameraman. It was kind of crazy. Um, are you sure that that just wasn't me farting. Nope, it was a very large explosion that was made by the dodgeball he threw. I think this classic cameraman just threw an explosive dodgeball. Oh, and I see some explosive diarrhea earlier after that Taco Bell. Um, wait, what? Uh, don't worry about it. Uh huh, sure thing, buddy. But Pip, things are getting kind of crazy. I might need your help a little bit here. Um, Louis, you do not need my help. We're going fine. Uh, I don't think so, buddy. I'm looking at this UFO toilet and it's kind of getting through and oh it's got just a tiny bit of health left yep we will kill it just stop complaining louie and start playing the game okay fine but um pip toilets are getting through now the toilets are getting through i repeat the toilets are making their way in no they're not uh yeah they're not because i'm upgrading now i just want to upgrade my classic cameraman some bags oh well then get your money up but i 
it costs so much money. Oh, well, maybe stop being poor then. Um, it's not as easy as it sounds, Pip. Being poor is not a lifestyle choice. Oh, Pip, this is getting kind of crazy. I just want to upgrade my classic cameraman, but um, you're kind of not carrying me very much. I'm carrying just fine, actually. Fun fact. Oh, maybe you should put down some more pumpkin farmers. I think that would be a good idea. All right. Time for the army of pumpkin farmers to start. All right. Well, go ahead and do it quick before we take a lot of damage from these UFO toilets because that is not going to be fun when this happens. I mean, look, this guy has 200,000 health and he is uh, kind of getting in. Pip, I need your help. Uh, what do you mean, Louise? He is dying. Look, he's about to die. Are you sure? I don't know about that, Pip. I, I think we might need some more leprechauns down here. Oh, fine. Put as many leprechauns as we can. All right, come on. Please, please, please do enough damage. Please. Please. Oh, no, Pip. I think we're cooked. Easy. Bro, oh, we just took 300 damage. If one more toilet gets through here, it's over for us, okay? Oh, well, we're not dead yet, buddy -o pal Uh, well, it feels like we will be in a second. Trust me. Um, Pip, I think I need to go ahead and upgrade this classic cameraman. That is what I need right now. I need this guy to do so much DPS that it's crazy. And look, we're wave 25. We're halfway through nightmare mode. <laughs> Oh, we can do it, buddy. We can do this. I believe. Oh, come on, Louie. I want to keep singing copyrighted music. Uh, no, you can't do that, buddy. You can't do that. I'm not letting you. Oh, fine. But, Pip, sometimes I wish I had Santas right now because, uh, I'm gonna be honest, we are not getting very far. Oh, is it because you're broke as a joke? No, it's not because I'm broke. It's because it's hard to do damage when you don't have any money. AKA, you're broke. Um, buddy, I am not broke. You're the broke one here, I think. Um, um, that literally doesn't make any sense. I have more money than you. Oh, no, you don't. Uh, wait, how much money do you have? Oh, uh, yes, you do. Yeah, so maybe stop complaining and get your money up. Um, Pip, I literally only make $100 every round. I'm kind of relying on you killing the toilets for me to do anything. I need you to kill the toilets to make me money. Well, what do you think I'm doing, buddy? I'm not sitting around eating popcorn. Well, it kind of feels like you are. You might need to start killing some toilets for me really quick because uh, I'm broke again. Oh, fine. I'll put down... I can place down two more leprechauns, so I will do that. All right. Go ahead, buddy. We are getting kind of far, and we have a lot of leprechauns placed down. This is kind of crazy, and look! This toilet has a million health, and we just killed it! I'm pretty sure that our units are able to handle nightmare mode, but uh, I'm gonna be honest with you as well. I don't know about that, because uh, we are kind of having trouble. If we go a few more waves, we might start struggling a bit. Oh, come on. We will never struggle. Are you sure? I mean, uh, can you look at us, Pip? Some of these toilets are getting to the middle, but if they get past our leprechauns, we're cooked. Oh, well, we're not gonna be turning into KFC today. Yeah, I hope so, but wait, Pip, look at this buzzsaw mutant toilet. Why does it look like that? Look at its face. Oh, he's trying to troll us. Oh, it's that troll derpy face. Yes, it's the troll face, and yeah, he's gonna die. There's no way he gets through. Boop, there we go. No toilets allowed past this point. Yep, at least not past the point that you've made. Look at all of these leprechauns. Uh, I call this the leprechaun checkpoint. Yep, and you know what I call the, this area over here? Uh, the area that doesn't kill any toilets at all. No, the, the, the classic, um, the classic, uh, the classic camp. Yeah, Louis, uh, <laughs> stick to your day job. Oh, whatever. Anyways, Pip, we're almost on wave 30. This is the furthest we've ever gotten. And I swear, if we lose this, I'm going to rage quit. We got so far. No, buddy, we're going to win this. Matter of fact, I'm turning on auto skip. What? Auto skip. Are you sure about that, buddy? I think we might die if you do that. I am absolutely positive. All right, well, go ahead. But if we cannot kill these toilets, I'm blaming this all on you that we didn't win. Oh, well, if we die, I'm blaming it all on you. Uh, wait, Pip, can we uh, turn auto skip off really quick? Maybe uh, we should wait until I've maxed out my classic cameraman before we do that. All right, only we out turn off auto skip. Phew. Okay, let's do it for the time being. Uh, as soon as I upgrade it, I will tell you. I I've been saving up for quite a while. All right, just uh, go ahead and keep saving up. Yep, I'm doing that right now. I'm doing that right now. Just kill a few more of these big toilets and they'll make me 500 bucks each. And uh, have you still got auto skip on? Yep. Turn it off. Why? Please. We're so close to me being able to upgrade. My classic cameraman won't wake up. Oh, well, not my problem. Yes, it is. Oh my gosh. You know what? I maxed him out now. I maxed him out. I maxed him out, but he's still asleep. Oh, tell me. Wake up! Uh, 
I wish I could, Pip, but you're not really making it easy. Oh, no, no, no. I just need to upgrade my leprechauns over here. My resistance point right here will kill them. Okay, but Pip, I got my classic cameraman pretty much maxed out now. I just need to hope he can do something. And Pip, how are you getting along over there? Viva la resistance! Let's kill them! <laughs> what are you talking about? If we're done for. We're literally dead. We're dead! Not my problem. No, that's all your problem. You know what? I'm blaming this all on you. I'm going back to the lobby. All right, Pip. I'm going to be honest with you. I am honestly going to rage quit. There's no way we just spent that long trying to get the legendaries through nightmare mode. And you made us lose! Oh, well, maybe if we put down some leprechauns instead of some trash cameraman, we would win. Oh, you know what? Whatever. I'm placing 500 units down against the strongest toilets in Toilet Tower and Ethan. At the end, we'll face off against the mothership. But let's see if we can beat the others first. Oh, Louie, I don't think we're going to beat the mothership. But if we do, I will give you 10,000 Robux. What's 10,000 Robux? And what are we waiting for, buddy? Let's go to Endless Mode. Up, up, and away. All right, Pip, so here we are. But before we can go ahead and beat the mothership in Toilet Tower Defense, we need to check whether we can beat all of the other bosses, okay? All right, Olivia. Um, I forget. What bosses are even in this game? Well, there are a few of them. There is the Astro Toilet, like the giant smooth toilet that looks like Michael Jackson. And you've also got stuff like the giant turkey toilet. Oh, I love the Pip Toilet. Uh, Pip, there is no Pip Toilet in this game. I'm sorry to tell you. Oh, it's coming soon, I swear. No, it's not. There is no Pip Toilet in this game. And uh, I'm sorry to say this, Pip, but there never will be. Oh, Louis, dreams can come true. Uh, yeah, maybe if you're the developer of Toilet Tower Defense. But sadly, you are not. Uh-huh. How do you know that? Uh, Pip, because I've talked to Talanthric before. And he says that you're an annoying little duck. Oh, uh, well, I'm pretty sure Talanthric is just me on my old account. Uh, no, he's not. Talanthric <laughs> literally told me that he has no idea who you are. He literally said it so many times that it was kind of sad to see. Oh, yeah, Louis. Well, if I'm not Talanthric, how can I do this? <laughs> What are you doing? I'm Talanthric. Are you okay? Do I have to take you to a hospital? I'm not okay. I'm Talanthric. Okay, buddy. I don't know what's going on with you, but I don't think I want to know. Oh, look, Louie. I'm like a lawnmower. <laughs> Pip, what are you doing? I'm just doing Talanthric things right now. All right, Pip. Well, how about we do Talanthric things and play this game? And then we can test and see if some of the strongest bosses in this game can be beaten by our strategy. I don't need units. I can just eat the toilets. Uh, Pip, I don't think that's working. But anyways, let me show you something that I learned recently. Using a little bit of Sigma hacking skills, I can go ahead and type a command called individual. Using my Sigma hacking skills and typing set individual limit enabled and then typing false, I can place more than three Santas. Look at this, buddy. I just did something illegal. I placed down four Four Santas! Um, only we you can't place down four Santas. You can only place down three. Uh, well, explain then how there's two of us in this game. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven Santas. That should be impossible. No, Louie. There has to be a third person in the game that put this Santa down. You can't place down more than three. Nope. And look at this, buddy. I'm going to do it again. I'll just put down another one. And now I've got five Santas. Hey, Bro, I'm not hacking. I'm just chilling like a villain. Come on, Louis. Tell me the hacks you're using. I want to use them too. Buddy, I am not using any hacks. I literally don't know what you're talking about. I'm just using my Sigma commands. Oh, I don't care about your mewing commands. Oh, well, Pip, maybe you should use them as well because you're a partner. I'm even going to change things like my placement limits. Look, I can change my placement limit to 100,000 units. So now I can put down 100,000 units before the game stops oh, me. Oh, yeah, Louis. Well, I just pulled up my super official hacking device, and now I can place down 100 DJ TV men. All right, well, that's pretty cool, Pip, but you've always been able to place down infinite of them. Not true. I don't believe you. Uh, well, you should, buddy, because uh, I know more about this game than you do, and I also know that if we don't start placing down 
some good units, we're gonna die! Come on, we can just survive on green lasers, right? No, we cannot only survive on green lasers. I think we might need a little leprechaun cameraman to spice things up. And look, now we can just destroy these toilets! Oh, the jolly old leprechaun coming to save the day! Yes, he's very jolly, just like one of my friends that you don't know about. Oh, are you talking about Santa Claus? No, I'm not talking about Santa Claus. Oh, well, I need to have a word with Santa Claus. He did not give me any presents last year. He gave me coal. Yeah, well, you kind of deserve coal. But anyways, Pip, look, we're on our first boss. And we are literally destroying it. This is wave 10. And I'm going to be honest, the large glasses toilet is super weak. We could easily kill this thing. Oh, yeah, baby. Send that toilet back to where it came from. Woohoo! Look, buddy, now I'm getting so much money from these Santas every single round that I'm pretty much earning, what, 5, 10, 15, 20, 2,000. $500 a round. Oh, only we finally are getting rich at the game. It only took you five months. Uh, buddy, I'll tell you something. I've always been rich at this game. But anyways, you know what I think we need to do? We need to start placing down some bosses and seeing whether we can destroy them. So I'm going to use my little hacking command. And I'm going to type on toilet. And then I will spawn in a boss toilet. And let's see if we can kill it. I'll just put one of them in on wave 10. And uh, there we go. We now have ourselves a boss toilet spawned in. And I'm going to be honest, guys. This guy has 50,000 health, but he is nothing compared to our leprechaun. Oh, leprechauns are still the best unit in the game. Forget the ultimate units when we have the leprechaun. Yep, I'm a big fan of piercing damage. It's super strong. But Pip, you know what isn't super strong? The amount of money I have in my bank account. So I'm going to go ahead and keep upgrading my Santas. Oh, I think I'm going to place down a thousand Santas. All right, buddy. You place down a lot of them, but don't fill the entire map. We still need some space to be able to, uh, you know, place down other units. Well, no, think about it, Louis. If you cover the entire map in Santas while you still can and then delete them, you'll have a small load of a million dollars in no time. All right, well, Pip, you do your strategy and I'll do mine. And we will see who has more money at the end, okay? Spoiler alert, it's going to be me. Uh, spoiler alert, you're going to be poorer than me. I don't even know what poor means, because I'm not poor. Uh, yes, you are, Pip. But anyways, come on, let's see. We can kill these minigun toilets quite quickly. We only need one leprechaun to kill all of these guys. They are literally so strong. I did not expect the leprechaun to be this powerful. Holy, the leprechaun has always been powerful. I'm surprised they haven't nerfed it yet. Yeah, me too. This leprechaun is literally so strong. And the best part is, it cannot even be stunned. So, it will never fall asleep, which means we can place, like, a billion of them. And I'm pretty sure we will never, ever be able to lose ever again. We're going to be number one on the leaderboard in no time. Hopefully, Talanda doesn't watch this video of us hacking, though. Yeah, that would be bad. But anyways, Pip, every single time we go ten rounds ahead, I will spawn in a new boss. And once we get to, like, wave 50, I'll spawn in the mothership! How much health does the mothership have? Let me I'm really scared of it. Well, that's the thing, Pip. I don't know. But since it's called the Mothership, I would expect it to have a lot of health. There's a Mothership. Who is the Fathership? I don't know, Pip, but I think, uh, I don't want to find out. I think the Fathership would be way more stronger than the Mothership. And I'm glad they haven't added it to the game yet. So is the Mothership the final boss? Yep. I'm pretty sure in Toilet Tower Defense, the Mothership is literally the strongest toilet that can possibly spawn. So we need to make sure that before we spawn it, we have a lot of OP units. I'll be ready. Trust me, I've already got down about uh, 10,000 Santas. Yeah, but Pip, look, we're killing our third boss, the flying dual buzzsaw toilet, and this thing is d -d 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 dead. That was easy peasy. But what I think I'm going to do is slap down a DJ TV man, and I'm going to put all of these leprechauns inside of the DJ's range, and now they're 25% stronger and 25% faster. It's crazy how fast these toilets are dying. Yep, we could just kill them as they walk out of spawn. But uh, wait a second. We went to wave 30, and I didn't even spawn in another boss. So let me go ahead and do that. I'll go ahead and do the command spawn toilet. And let's see, what boss toilet do we want next? Oh, I have an idea. Let's do a magnet scientist toilet. These guys are pretty strong, but I think we can defeat them. So let's just do this. And is it a boss? Yes, it is. And boom. Now we have a magnet scientist scientist toilet that has six million health on its way. This guy is very, very strong. I hope we can kill him. He's not going to have six million health for long, buddy. Just wait till the leprechauns target him and then bam! Yeah, look at all that damage! 
we are literally beaming this man. He is being destroyed. Magnet scientist toilet, yep. Your time has come to go poop. Magnet scientist toilet, more like magnet scientist loser. Oh, just like Louie. Uh, Excuse me, I am not a loser, but Pip, we are kind of lagging a little bit here. Did you see that? The whole game lagged for a second. It may or may not be because of my 100 Santas. Yeah, we have so many units now that the game is starting to lag. But look, we killed that magnet scientist toilet. We are literally so OP. There is no way we lose endless mode. Come on, this is impossible. Yeah, Pip, and I'm going to be honest. With all the Santas that I have, I'm making a bunch of money. Look how much money I have. Hey, how do you have a million? You didn't even place down that many Santas. Well, buddy, it's the power of compound interest. If you put down a lot of Santas, you'll get a lot of money. Um, I literally placed down more Santas, Louis, so that doesn't make any sense. I'm sorry, buddy. It's just how it is. You're poor, and I'm rich. And look, I'm literally upgrading all of my leprechauns to max right now. These guys are going to be so strong that I don't think I will see a single boss toilet make their way through. And you have the DJ TV man. Oh, these leprechauns are going crazy. Yep, yeah, they're gonna be insane, buddy. I just need to make sure that I upgrade all of these leprechauns. I cannot miss a single one. If I miss one, then we will be losing out on a lot of valuable damage. Come on, Louie. I'll even place down some of my leprechauns. Now, I don't want to see a single toilet come out of spawn because they're just going to die instantly. Oh, yeah. I mean, literally, look at this, Pip. We're on wave 36 and look at all these toilets. They walk out of spawn and go to zero health straight Away. These toilets remind me of when I talk to girls. As soon as I talk to them, they just uh, disappear. Um, what? Wait, uh, Pip, are you saying that when you talk to girls, they die like these toilets in Toilet Tire Defense? No, they just instantly poof like these toilets. As soon as I see them, they are gone. They poof? Are you saying to me that you have L Riz right now? Uh, no. Uh, yes, you are. Guys, comment down below if you think Pip has L Riz. I literally have Sigma Riz, and Pip has zero. You wouldn't even know how to riz up a girl if she was right in front of your face. Uh, yes, I would, buddy. I rizzed up Livy Dunn. Oh, wait, you rizzed up Lizzo? Good job, Louie. You rizzed up Lizzo. Wait, Lizzo? No, I didn't riz up Lizzo. And who did you riz up? Livy Dunn! I don't think Paul Schemed would be happy about that. But anyways, if you rizzed up Livy Dunn, what is her favorite sport? Uh, baby Gronk? Um, no, Louie, it's gymnastics, not baby Gronk. I did not know it was gymnastics. Uh, sorry, Pip. I'm just not hip with the kids nowadays. Okay, old man. Go back to the retirement home. Hey, I don't actually live in a retirement home. I was just making a joke, okay? Uh-huh. Sounds like something a person in a retirement home would say. Uh, I I'm not in a retirement home. But anyways, Pip, look. Our leprechauns shoot out so many beams all at once that it lags the game. But watch this, buddy. All of these toilets have three million health. And they die before they can even walk a few steps. I think it's time that we spawn in another boss toilet. What do you think? Bring out the big guns, Louie. All right, I'm gonna bring out a much stronger toilet. Let's spawn in a beret rocket launcher toilet. These guys are pretty strong. Let's go ahead and put one and let's make it a boss. So here it is. This guy has six million health and he died instantly. Louie, did you place down the beret rocket launcher dude yet? I, I haven't seen him. Yes, I did. He just died. You know what? Let me make him stronger. I will double the waves. Here we go. This guy should have like 12 million health. And boom. There we go. This guy has 25 million health. And, um, Pip, I'm pretty sure he's almost dead. Yeah, he doesn't have 25 million health for long. There is no way we just killed that thing that easily. Pip, how did we do that? Well, a little bit of blood, sweat, and tears gets you pretty far. All right, but uh, Pip, have you got any toilets that you want to see us kill? Oh, I would love to see us kill a mutant toilet. A mutant toilet? Bro, those things are really, really sad to watch die. But let's go ahead and do it. Let's spawn in a mutant toilet like this. Let's put him to wave 100. And let's turn him into a boss. And he died so quickly, I did not even see him. Louis, are you going to place him down? Or what? You know what? I'm going to add wave 400 to this guy, and hopefully this guy will be stronger. And boom. This guy has 270 million health. Uh, Louis, uh, are you crazy? Why did you give up 270 million health? What's wrong with that, buddy? We can easily kill him. And if we cannot, then I'll, I'll just go ahead and give myself B-tools. <laughs> yeah, you might need to give yourself B-tools, because we might be in a little bit. 
bit of a pickle. Bro, we are not going to die to this mutant toilet because I know exactly how to kill it. I'll just go into the explorer, go to the attacker's page like this. And, oh, you see that mutant toilet right there? Mm -hmm. Oh, he, he's dead now. He's dead. We totally killed him. Look, we killed him. What? Did you just use slash slash delete on the mutant toilet? No, I use slash slash paste. Louie, I don't know what slash slash paste is, but good job, I guess. Yep, thank you very much, Pip. But anyways, I'm going to put down a Titan Firework Man now because I want to start doing some crazy damage. And the more Titan Firework Man we have, the crazier this will get. So look at the amount of damage we're doing right now, Pip. I do not even see any toilets coming out of that spawn door. We are literally so strong, it's sad. Come on, who's number one on the leaderboard? Because we are coming for your spot. Yeah, we're definitely going to take that number one spot on the leaderboard, buddy. We are so strong. It's insane. I'm literally having to turn off my graphics quality because of how crazy laggy all these electrophones are. Yep, yeah, um, Pip, maybe it's just because whenever you try to put down a Santa, there's about 100 Santas on the map, so it lags you out. Maybe you should try and, uh, you know, reset your character. Well, I've been deleting a lot of my Santas, Louie, so hopefully that helps the lag. You know what? I'm also going to be turning down my graphics quality a little bit because we are lagging like crazy. You know what? the developers don't let people play so many units. There's a reason. Yeah, it's literally because it would break the game otherwise. But, Pip, we are coming close to wave 50, and I want to see what boss toilet comes out from here, and then we can spawn one of our own. Well, while you do that, I'm going to place down more leprechauns so we can lag even more. All right, buddy, go ahead and do that, and oh, I'm lagging so bad. Uh, well, you better get used to it, Louie, because it's only going to get worse from here. I know, but, Pip, wait. Wave 50 has started. We are about to see exactly what this boss looks like. Come on. How much health is this guy going to have? Let's find out. And he has 30 million health. Look at how quick he just died. Boom. He's dead. 13 million health is no match for us, buddy old pal. Yep. Yeah, maybe we need stronger toilets. So, you know what I'm going to spawn in? I'm going to spawn in a Magnet Titan. Let me just spawn a toilet with my commands. Magnet Titan toilet. Let's put him to wave. Uh, 50. And let's spawn in one of them as a boss. Boom! And Pip, this guy should have a lot of health. He has 85 million health! Not for long, Louie. He's about to die! Yeah, Pip, I'm pretty sure we are literally invulnerable. We are literally unkillable by this Magnet Titan toilet. It's going to die so fast. Do you think we're prepared for the mutant mothership yet? Uh, I'm not sure, buddy. I'm not sure. I mean, if we can kill this Magnet Titan, then surely we should be able to kill the mothership. But if this Magnet Titan has 87 million health, I don't want to know how much health the mothership is going to have. She probably has like a billion. Well, duh, buddy, because she is going to be the mothership. But, Pip, I'm going to be honest with you. We are starting to lag pretty bad. I'm pretty sure we have so many units placed down now that the game is starting to struggle. Come on, we can still put down some more leprechauns without my computer breaking, hopefully. I think I'm okay, buddy. I think I'll just place down Titan Firework Men for now. They're a lot bigger and they do a lot more damage. Guys, F in the chat for our computers. F in the chat. Yeah, my PC is going to explode in just a second. But, Pip, I think it's time for us to spawn in an even stronger boss because we need to get that mothership spawned in soon and I want to see if we are prepared for it. So I'm going to do the next best thing. I'm going to spawn in an astro toilet because those things are pretty darn strong. Let's see it happen. So let's spawn in this astro toilet and boom! This guy has 25 million health! This is way less! Oh, look at this little weakster over here. This guy has way less health than that magnet titan we just spawned. But you know what? Let me go ahead and double the health of this guy. I'm going to put him to wave 80. And now he should have a lot more health. Boom! There he is. And he has 70 million health. Pip, I think this might be the end. I'm still waiting for you to put down an actual good toilet, Louie. Pip, this thing is a good toilet. Look how fast it is. And look how much health it has. Louie, it literally has zero health. Oh, yeah, because we just killed it, buddy. And we're going to kill these toilets even faster now since I placed down some more leprechauns. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we are literally destroying this game right now. And I'm pretty sure we are kind of destroying the game because I'm lagging so bad. Look, if I just move my camera around, eventually it's going to lag really bad. Watch this. Boom, 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 boom. And here comes the lag. Here comes the lag. Ah! My computer sounds like a plane engine right now. It's just going...
Yeah, Pip. All I can hear right now is wee, like from my my fans and stuff. You know. Your biggest fans are going crazy. Yeah, and more like my computer fans are going crazy. But Pip, you know what could be even crazier? The amount of Titan firework men I have. So I'm going to put more of them down. Oh, come on, Louis. I don't want to see a speck of this map not covered in a unit. If we want to beat that mothership, we are going to need as many units as we can. You know what? I'm going to use some admin commands to give myself a little bit of cash money. So let me just go ahead and do this. Give myself like, I don't know, $10 million. And let's go ahead and fill this map up with Titan Firework Man. Titan Firework Man and the Leprechaun combo. It's like the new combo at McDonald's. Uh, the new combo? Wait, they made a new combo at McDonald's? I need to try it right now. Yep, it's called the Leprechaun and Firework Cameraman combo. Oh, no, you're definitely lying to me, buddy. It's not called that. <laughs> Well, just go to your McDonald's and ask the cashier for the Leprechaun and Titan Fire combo. And the cashier is going to be like, uh, what is that? Uh, yeah, Pip, because it doesn't exist. That's why they'll be asking what it is. No, no, I swear. It's a secret menu item. A secret menu item. Pip, you're worse than the girls who go to Starbucks asking for the secret pumpkin spice latte. Well, Louie, when I go to Starbucks, I get a vanilla bean latte with extra drizzle, two pumps of chocolate loco. Pip! Pip. No, that is a really long order. But you want to know what my Starbucks order is? Well, Louis, I only said it like quarter of my whole order. But go ahead, tell us your order. Okay, so I get a uh, double spice latte with uh, three whipped cream pumps with five pumps of pure sugar with about nine pumps of steroid cream in it. So I'm strong. And then I add a bunch of milk chocolate. I add some more sugar. I put some more marshmallows in there. And then I also add five dashes of toilet tower defense skill. And then I add 50 dashes of Pip being trash at the game. No, Louie, that doesn't sound like a good coffee. I want to try the quad long shot grante in a vendi cup, half half, double cup, no sleeve, salted caramel mocha latte with two pumps of vanilla. Substitute two pumps of white chocolate mocha for mocha and substitute two pumps of hazelnut for toffee nut, half whole milk and half breeze with no whipped cream, extra hot, extra what? Food, extra caramel, what? extra ginger, Pip! extra salt, and a scoop Pip! of vanilla bean powder with light well. Pip! Stop speaking! Uh, Louie, I was only halfway through. Pip, that is the longest order I've ever heard, but I don't know if I want to hear any more Starbucks orders ever again in my life. Oh, uh, well, uh, there's a reason people don't like to work at Starbucks. Yeah, probably because you go in there. And I expect them to memorize my whole order. If they memorized your whole order, they deserve a raise, buddy. Oh, fine. I'll give them a raise. I'll give them a one penny raise. All right, Pip. Look, we are on wave 62 right now, and I think it's time for us to try spawning in some British strong toilets. So I'm going to get a very strong one placed in. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. All right. Well, let me go ahead and type spawn toilets and we are going to fight the rabid rabbits toilets from the Easter event. So let's put one of these down and boom. Here it comes, buddy. The rabid rabbit toilet is about to come out of that spawn right now. Let's just wait for it and uh, wh where is it? It's supposed to be coming out any second now. Where is it? Did it die already? I don't know, Pip. The game is lagging quite bad, and everything is starting to get really weirdly colored. But come on. Come on, where's this rabid rabbit? Oh, Louie, I see it on my screen. Maybe your computer's already broken. Yep, there it is. And it has, like, 75 million health, but not anymore because it just died. We might be getting a little too crazy in this game. You know what they said. We might be getting a little too crazy in this game, Louie. You know what the Hulk said. With great power comes great responsibility. What? The Hulk said that? But what? Whatever, Pip. It doesn't matter. Look, there's another Astro Toilet. And this guy has 132 million health. Don't worry, Louie. I've been placing down more leprechauns. So we can handle it. Yep. And, oh, wait, uh, can we? It seems to be getting through. And this guy has 60% uh, of his health left. And he is uh, still getting through here, buddy. Trust me, Louie. We'll be fine. Are you sure? It seems like things are getting out of hand. This guy is uh, losing less and less health every second. Louie. He's literally about to die. Chillax. All right, I'm watching. I'm watching, buddy. 10 million health. 5 million health. And I'm pretty sure he's going to be dead any second. Um, Pip, is it me or is this toilet taking a long time to die? And, oh, we killed it. Yeah, Louie, I think your game is lagging a lot. That dude's been dead for like a good 10 seconds. Yeah, my game's lagging. Maybe I should reset my character and it should fix some stuff. There we go. I reset and, no, nope, I'm still lagging really, really bad, Pip. Well, how did you just place down a thousand Titan Firework Men? Wait, what do you mean, why did I place down a thousand of them? Because I can. And because they're all max upgraded and so strong they could kill anything. Well, 
Oh, my leprechauns are better. Uh, no, they're not. The Titan Firework Man is so OP. It does 100,000 damage every second. Only 100,000 damage? Louie, my leprechauns do 25,000 DPS a second. Bro, that's like no damage at all. 25,000 DPS compared to 112,000 DPS? Um, Pip, I think you're delusional right now. Well, no. Think about it. Think about it. It takes up space to place one of these firework men. And these firework men are huge. They can take up about four leprechauns. So technically, you're actually saving more space by using these leprechauns. So it is the smarter business strategy. A smarter business strategy. Well, Pip, it sounds like a doo-doo business strategy to me. But anyways, I think it's time that we spawn in a stronger toilet. And I have an idea on what. I'll just type in spawn toilet. And I'll put in a carrier astro toilet. Pip, these things are ridiculously strong. I hope you're ready. Because here it comes! Come on, Louie. Let's bring it on. All right. Right, here it comes. We just have to wait a little bit because it kind of seems like it's taking its time to get out of the spawn here. Oh, I see it. The carrier astro toilet. All right, carrier astro. I might not be able to see because of all the fireworks and leprechauns. And wait, did he just do a barrel roll? I don't know. But all right, let's see you die. Uh, Pip, are you okay? Are, are, are you, uh, do you need to go to a hospital? Because I cannot see anything. And oh, wait, here it is. Look, he's getting blown up by all these fireworks. It is July. Fourth all over again. Wait, whoa. He literally is doing barrel rolls as well. He's like flipping around, doing circles. But our firework men are destroying him. He's not even able to get like a tiny bit closer. He's on like 50% of his health already. But look, he's spawning little toilets out of him. Just give him a few seconds and he'll spawn another one. It's like little tiny versions of him. He can poop out all the toilets that he wants. They are going to help him. Yeah, they <laughs> die so quickly that I don't even think he can spawn them anymore. But look, there it is. An interceptor astro toilet. That's like a tiny little guy. Let me spawn in a few of those. A spawn toilet. Interceptor astro toilet. And I'll spawn in like a 10 of them with a one second delay. And look, there's a bunch of little ones coming out of the spawn. They look so tiny and cute. Holy but Pip, I think we need to be worrying about the carrier astro toilet right now. Because this is going to be the final boss toilet we fight before the mothership. Well, I'm trying to watch him die. But maybe I have to go kind of far away to see. Stop me lagging. Come on, guys. I'm going to climb up that mount mountain. All right, Pip. I'll just stay down here and tell you what's going on. It seems like we are killing these carrier astro toilets pretty quickly. Look, this one has 5% of its health left. It's pretty much dead. And we did it, Pip. We killed the carrier astro toilet. But do you know what's left for us to try and kill? The mothership. The mothership. So let's go ahead and do the command spawn toilet. And let's spawn the mothership in. And here it comes, buddy. Are you ready? I'm ready to rumble. The mothership. And this guy has two billion health. No issue for us, Louie. Look, the mothership's already about to die. Are you sure, buddy? This thing has 98% of its health left. And it's still going to take a while until we can kill it. Look at how much health it has. This is insane. Well, I can just put another leprechaun down. Come on, let me put this leprechaun down and upgrade it. And maybe this will help. Pip. We have an entire map full of units. I have 101 units placed down. And we have only gotten 5% of this guy's health taken down. How do the developers expect people to defeat the mothership if us hackers can't even defeat it? I don't know, buddy. The mothership is one of the strongest toilets in Toilet Tower Defense. And this is a toilet that you will only see if you get to wave 150. So basically impossible to see. Yep, you will never see it. But this toilet is kind of crazy, buddy. I'm just placing down some DJs to hopefully make it easier for us to kill it. Because this thing has only lost 8% of its health. We might be doomed. No, nope, we're not doomed. Not on my watch, buddy. I'm gonna place down so many DJs that we will be able to DJ our way out to victory. Well, I'm trying to place down these leprechauns, Louie, but they take like 5 to 10 business days to actually place down because of the lag. Are you kidding me? Well, don't worry, Pip. We should be okay as long as this mothership dies. Come on, come on, come on. We're literally doing no damage. We might need Need to get a new strategy, buddy. Come on, Louie. I said I would give you 10,000 Robux if we beat the mothership. Guess like I'm saving my 10,000 Robux today. Yep, well, I literally just need to get that Robux in my bank account. Come on, toilet! 
should just die already. The mothership is already halfway across the map. How do you expect him to lose 80% of his health in about 20 seconds? Uh, I don't know, Pip, but I'm really hoping it can because that would be really sad for me if it doesn't. Come on. I'll just put down more Titan Firework, man. I'll put like a bunch more down. Max him out. Max him out. Come on. Come on. Come on, Louis. We don't have all day. Pip, I know. But look, Pip, it's starting to lose a lot more health. I think the Firework men are working. This should be fine if I just place more and more and more and more and more. We should be able to kill it. Louis, the mothership is literally immune. You can see it above your head. So he's immune to dying. There is no way he is immune to dying. He has to be able to die or else it would literally be impossible for us to win. Has anyone ever actually beaten the mothership? Because I don't think it's actually possible. I'm not sure, buddy. This guy is literally a flying UFO of death. He only lost 30% of his health. We could literally barely do enough damage to kill him. We are Done. Yeah, buddy. I think we're doomed. That was insane. I did not expect him to have that much health. Maybe if we were on a shorter wave, it would be way easier. Yeah, Pip. We did manage to do one billion damage, though, to that guy. We just didn't manage to fully kill him. But anyways, I think it's time to go back to the lobby. All right, Pip. So here we are back in the lobby, buddy. And that was the most crazy game of Toilet Tower Defense I think I've ever seen. Yeah, Louie. And that is the craziest game because I Robux and I actually won. Oh, well, whatever. You won this time around, but next time you won't be winning so easily. All right, so as you guys know, every toilet in this huh? game, Toilet Tower Defense, has a unit huh? of its own. So, for example, the boss toilet has the boss toilet unit, and the strider toilet has the strider toilet unit. But today we're going to be testing out all of these units against their own toilet counterparts and see if we can beat them. Well, maybe I bet you a thousand Robux that None of these toilet units can beat their real toilet counterparts. Bro, are you kidding me? Have you seen these toilet units? They do so much DPS. Bro, they are totally going to be able to do it. But you know what? There's only one way to find out. Let's go to endless mode. <laughs> Alrighty, Pip. So here we are. We got a bunch of toilets and we got a bunch of Santas. So first of all, I'm going to need some Santas to be placed down because I need the oh, money. Get your money, honey. I have zero dollars, so I'm going to place down zero units. Yeah, thank you very much, Pip. I appreciate it. But buddy, we don't even really need the Santas, to be honest with you. We literally have infinite money because we are in the Partner Experiments server. Wait, 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 wait. What? We're in Partner Experiments right now? I could tell with the fact that I had 900,000 gems in the lobby. Yeah, duh, literally, look at this, bro. I can set the toilet's huh? movement multiplier to zero, and we literally just froze time. Bro, what kind of facts are you doing right now? I don't know, buddy, but this is really cool. I mean, look at this, bro. We are literally able to freeze time like Quicksilver and kill all these toilets before they even leave the spawn. Easy, easy. Lemon squeezy. Yeah, we're getting on the leaderboards now. Yeah, well, we don't really need to be on the leaderboards, to be fair with you, Pip. We're in partner experiments. Everybody can get on the leaderboard. But what we need to do is give ourselves some money. So I'm going to add myself some money. And I'm going to give myself a good, like, I don't know, a million dollars. I'm going to give myself a small loan. Can I have a million dollars, please, Louie? I've been a great duck. No, babe, you cannot have a million dollars. But what we can do is we can start testing out all these toilets with their toilet counterpart now. So what I'm going to do is, first of all, I'm going to kill all of these little toilets here. So I need to get rid of these guys. So can a scientist toilet kill a scientist toilet, Pib? What do you think? Absolutely not. I told you, Louie, I put a thousand robots on the line. Well, let's find out then, shall we? Let's spawn in a scientist toilet. But first, I need to find out how to spawn the toilet. I think I just have to type a spawn. Spawn toilet. Yeah, spawn toilet, scientist toilet, wave one, amount one, delay one. Boss? Yes. Okay, there we go, Pip. Here it is. Bro, this thing is a wave one boss, and it has 500,000 health. Yeah, we're cooked. That's what huh? I'm telling you, Louie. You better get ready to hand me a thousand Robux. Buddy, I thought we had a better chance than this, but I don't honestly know about this, buddy. Wait, how much range does this spider toilet have? Uh, we might actually be able to do it. I mean, the scientist toilet has, what, a bit of, a good bit of DPS. Well, Louie, I don't think I've ever met someone more dumb in my entire life. I don't have to hand it to you. Bro, excuse me. This scientist toilet is literally about to die, bro. It's on 60% health. This thing's gonna be easy peasy lemon squeezy, bro. Bro, this thing is literally dead. He, he might be beefy, but he's literally going to die right now. He's already about to leave the scientist toilet unit's range. And uh, yeah, that's 
scientist toilet is going to get to our cameraman temple. Oh, yeah. Well, we're, we're not done yet, Pip. We're not done yet. We, we can literally move it, bro. We can literally move it. What? Nothing stopped us from literally being able to sell it and move it because literally, I'm, I'm talking to you right now, Pip. Okay, we only well, need one. We only need one. We only need one. Like, uh, we, we have uh, one scientist toilet. We're killing it. Okay, well, first of all, you should literally learn how to not keep using the word literally because you literally sound like you literally have a speech impediment. I may have a speech impediment, bro, but at least I'm not stupid. At least I'm not like you. Look, I'm killing this scientist toilet whether you like it or not, bro. This scientist toilet unit is scientist well, crazy, bro. It's taking you five to ten business days to kill this scientist toilet. He's already halfway across the map. And boom, you finally killed him. Well, I'm telling you, bro. I told you we could do it. The scientist toilet is the easiest toilet to kill when you have good units like the scientist toilet. So let's just say this. The scientist toilet unit could beat the scientist toilet boss. Now, boy, we have to test the next one out. The flamethrower toilet. What do you think, bro? This guy looks like me when I've eaten too much Taco Bell, bro. Look at this. He's spewing fire out of his booty. Oh, no, that's his face. Never mind. Well, let's see. The flamethrower toilet only does 10,000 DPS on that little flamethrower toilet. So I can show you how bad this unit is. Yeah, all right. Let's do it then, bro. Let me just go into the menu here and type spawn toilet. We just have to max out our flamethrower toilet and pray to every god known to humankind. The only person you're going to need to be praying to right now is Tolanthric, and he definitely isn't going to help you. Oh, come on, bro. Talanthric definitely would help me if I needed it. And and look, Talanthric was so kind to give me an OP unit to be able to kill these huh? things. You're telling me Talanthric, out of all the units in the game to give you, he gives you a epic flamethrower toilet unit. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Now look, Pip, it seems to be working. Oh, wow. The flamethrower is barely doing anything. Bro, yes, it is. Bro, we just killed two flamethrower toilets with one flamethrower toilet unit. I don't know about you, but this thing is insane. You're honestly trying to rig the results or something because the flamethrower toilet is slightly stronger, but the actual flamethrower toilet toilet is less stronger. So, yeah, you're definitely trying to rig something here. Bro, I do not know what you're talking about about rigging the results. But you know what? Just to prove myself right, instead of fighting one flamethrower toilet, how about we fight, like, five? Would that make you feel better? Yes, that would make me feel, like, ten times better. Let's do wave ten, and then let's fight five flamethrowers. You see, this guy has 558,000 health, Pip. Do you think we can beat this one? Absolutely not. Oh, I knew you were going to say that. You always say absolutely not, but we always beat it, Pip. Trust me. Let's put that to the test. These flamethrower toilets have a combined 100 million bajillion health. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Pip, that, this thing has 500,000 health, and I'm eating a potato right now. Uh, I might have carried the one a little bit, but anyways, let's see if this flamethrower toilet unit it can't take on the toilets. And yeah, spoiler alert, it can. Bro, it literally can. Look at the damage we're pumping out, bro. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, Pip. Yeah. That's so close. But wait, it's still dying because they're still burning. So technically, our flamethrower toilet was OP. Nope. The flamethrower toilet has gone past. Uh, has it, Pip? Because I can just I can just move this guy, you know? I can just do this. What? There we go. Bro, that's gotta be cheating. No, that's not cheating. It's actually relatively allowed. I don't have to do that, bro. Uh Okay, well, we know your flamethrower toilet unit sucks, and we know your scientist toilet unit sucks, but what about the other units? Since these units actually do DPS. All right, well, let's find out what we got. So we tried the scientist that was able to kill the counterpart. We tried the flamethrower that was also able to do that. But we do have the rocket launcher toilet next, Pip. And honestly, this thing is not going to lose, bro. This thing does insane DPS. It does 24,000 DPS. And look at its range. It, its range covers the entire map. This is way too OP. Come on, Evan, if you can hear me right now, buff this oh. rocket launcher toilet. It has a, uh, a bit too much range. All right, well, Pib, let's see if we can beat a rocket launcher toilet, shall we? So I'll put rocket toilet, wave 10. Actually, no, I'll do wave, uh, wave 30 because that would be even scarier. Pip, this thing has 450,000 health. This rocket launcher toilet is easily going to defeat it. I guarantee, bro. L look at the damage we're doing. No, no, no. Spawn multiple rocket toilets. Then it would actually be a fair fight. Uh, bro, I don't know about you, but this has always been a 
fair fight, regardless. I mean, we could literally just do it again. I mean, I, I mean, I, I'll do it. Do it again. Do it again, and do it like five or ten times. Or all right. Well, times. look, here comes five rocket toilets, and look, they're all dying at the same speed because we have that splash damage. No, they're not. Yes, they are, bro. I can literally see it right there. They're all dying. I don't believe you. Mm, well, you should, bro, because look, they're all gonna die. And boom. See, look, they all died, bro. That was literally easy. But I have to admit, we did kind of fight some wave um, 30 rocket toilets. Maybe we should fight some wave 50 ones. Huh? That could probably be a, a little scarier. And Oh, yeah, yeah. This is definitely scarier, bro. These things have 1 million health. Please do not die to the rocket toilet. You toilets are supposed to survive. Honestly, 1 million health. Th that might be a little bit too much for the rocket toilet to handle. But wait, they're actually on 70% health, bro. I think we might actually be able to handle this. Okay, yeah, we might actually have some issues here, Pip, I think. I've been waiting for some issues because I've been waiting for you to send me a thousand robots. Yeah, it kind of seems to me like we might actually lose this one. Y you know what? I'm going to put down another rocket launcher toilet. Maybe one of them couldn't defeat them, but two of them definitely can. Here we go. Two rocket launcher toilets. Blast them. Okay, yeah, we might actually lose this. This. You know what? I have no faith. I'm putting a boss toilet down. There we oh, go. Wait, wait, yeah. Wait, you just cheated. Okay, I cheated, Pip. What, what about it, bro? Uh, the rocket launcher toilet couldn't defeat the rocket toilet at wave 50. That That's just not possible. So are you going to give me the 1,000 Robux or what? Um, excuse me, bro. We literally killed the rocket launcher toilet like ages ago. I just upped the waves. That's all I did. I just made them stronger. So technically, I'm still kind of right. Okay, Yapatron 5,000. We'll go with that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, I am, I am kind of a Yapatron pit. But anyways, we need to test out the next toilet. Well, uh, what is the next toilet, Louie? Tell us. Well, that is the Strider toilet. So let me slap this guy down in the middle here. Upgrade him to max. And bro, why does he look like that? That's kind of creepy. I don't know, but he looks like he is huh? ready for a smooch. Uh, ew! Oh my gosh, Pip. No, don't kiss the... Ugh. Okay, I'm, I'm all right, bro. You're kissing a toilet right now. Do you, do you know how that looks? Well, come on. I'm sure the toilet's clean. Mm, yeah, you don't know what that toilet's been, buddy. Uh, look, it's literally rusty. Do you see the rust on its uh, on its arms? How do you know that's rust and not just poop? Uh, well, Pip, that's not a clean toilet if it has poop on it. But anyways, come on. We need to fight this Strider toilet against a Strider toilet. So let's go ahead and do that. So here we go. Let me just go into my commands. Spawn toilet, Strider toilet. And let's put it on wave... I'll do wave uh, 30 for now. We might be in for a real treat here. You might be in for a real treat, Louie. It's called a robbery. And I'm going to take all your Robux. Robbery? What do you mean? Are you trying to rob me, bro? What, what the heck? Yep, I'm trying to steal all your money. And that is exactly what I'm going to do. This strata toilet is not going to meet its maker. But why is it just standing still? Come on, move. Well, I have to admit, Pip, it is moving kind of quickly. I, I think we might actually have some issues with this thing. Maybe, maybe, I, maybe I need to slow it down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. These other toilets are doing tons of damage. He's making them fall asleep. He's not doing anything, bro. El Bozo. Bro, you're kidding me. You know what? I'm moving him back over here. This is a way better spot. I'll put him right yeah. here in the middle, and I should be able to kill that Strider Rocket Toilet when he comes around. You're really just going to let the Strider Rocket Toilet at 5% health walk across the whole entire map and still get past your Strider Toilet? Bro, it won't. My Strider Toilet does 72,000 damage. This guy has 85,000 damage. Watch. Boom. Why is the damage not that much, bro? What is going on here? And boom. See, I killed him. You barely killed him, Louie. I hope you realize that. No, bro. I literally killed him. You you, you literally saw that. I did that. I was hoping that your strata toilet was going to fall asleep and make you lose. Uh, well, uh, it's not going to let me lose. I, I'm pretty, pretty sure that these toilets, they want to help me. They don't want to hurt me. That's what the government wants you to think, Louie. But the government always lies. Yeah, to be fair, they do. They do. They do lie a lot. But anyways, Pip, enough about this. We need to now fight. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna spawn a boss toilet 1.0 to fight this guy and see if we can beat him. I can't wait to see you get destroyed. This boss toilet 1.0 is doo-doo. He doesn't even have any armor. Oh, 
Oh, yeah? Well, look. This boss toilet that's coming out of here has 188,000 health. This guy does, uh... Oh, 3,000 3, DPS. Okay, this might be a little bit... We, we might be in for a treat here, Pip. Yeah, and it looks like these flying boss toilets are also going to get past. Yeah, well, these guys are cheating. I'm, I'm not letting them through. These, these guys... These guys don't have toilet counterparts, so I'm gonna kill them, and then we're gonna focus on the boss. All right, buddy. Let's see if you keep this confidence against this boss toilet. All right, I'm just doing some damage right now, and there we go. Okay, he can easily kill this boss toilet. I guarantee it. Here we go. Boom. Oh, no. This damage is uh, not what I was hoping it would be. So, Louie, do you just want to give up now or later? Uh, I'll do it. I'll do it in a few business days, Pip. I I, I don't have much time to spare here. Um, who knew? Look, Pip, we're about to kill the boss toilet. We're getting really close. This is a really close fight, but I'm pretty sure we're coming out of it alive. We did it! You barely did that, Louie. You were hanging on just by a little bit of a thread. Bro, we totally did that. I did that all by myself as well. And the best part is, we can now test the next variant of this guy here. Look, I'm gonna upgrade this guy. Now we got boss toilet. Bro, no. This boss toilet 2.0 oh. only does 15,000 DPS and I'm sure the real toilet probably has like, oh, I don't know, 50 million health? Well, let's find out then, shall we? Let me just spawn in a boss toilet version. And now, boom, boss toilet 2.0 on his way, but I kind of need to kill all these other toilets first because uh, they're gonna get in the way of my little experiment, Pip. Alright, but here comes the boss toilet 2.0! Okay, we're having a bit of problems. I kind of can't kill the other toilets because this one's in the way. Uh, let me just sell the big boss toilet here. Uh, no, yeah, this that, is getting that, a bit crazy. That, that, is, that is cheating. You just use the boss toilet 4.0 to kill the <laughs> boss toilet 2.0. <laughs> Pip, it's not easy, bro. I have a bunch of toilets in the way. They're getting in the way, bro. Well, it honestly just seems like you're trash at the game. <laughs> Stop saying things like that. What, <laughs> trash, what does that mean? Bro, do you have something against the way I say words? <laughs> I have a lot of things against the way you say words because that's creepy. Yeah, well, maybe you should be focused on your hairline because you don't have one. Bro, says the guy with a wig. <laughs> Pip, you're making me laugh. I'm not, dis I'm distracted. Oh, am I making Louie feel bad? <laughs> that little, little Louie has a wig. Just, just do not say the word wig like that ever again, Pip. You scared me wig! a bit. Okay, that's fine. You said it fine there, but when you say it like wig, that's a bit weird. Okay, Louie, I guess I'll just stop speaking English just for you. Yeah, thank you, Pip. I would highly appreciate that because you were speaking really weird. It was starting to make me laugh. Well, we got ourselves a boss toilet 3.0. First, we got to do a bit of cleanup on aisle four and get rid of these big buzz saw toilets. And here it comes, Pip. This guy has almost two million health. So we have to uh, take this a bit seriously. So you really think your unit that does, what is that, how much DPS is that, uh, 5 DPS? Uh, yeah, Pip, I'm pretty sure this unit that does totally 5 DPS will be able to beat it. Look, it's already on 94% health, and it only walked through this tiny little section of the circle. That might not be a good sign for me, but anyways, let's see him getting up. Obliterated? Yep, yeah, obliterated. That's just, you know, that's just how it is, Pip. I just obliterate any toilet, I see. No, Boss Toilet 3.0, you have more health than that, right? You just, uh, you must have spawned the Boss Toilet 3.0 on, like, wave huh? one health. Mm -mm. No, I spawned it on wave 30, which is what we're on right now. We're on wave 33. Spawned it on wave 300 or something. Uh, bro, if I spawn it on wave 300, it'll be OP. I won't be able to kill it. Exactly, that's what I want to see. I want to see you lose. Uh, trust me, Pip, you do not want to see that. Oh, little Louie gonna get angry. Oh, yeah, I will, bro. But you saw that Boss Toilet 3.0 could kill the Boss Toilet 3.0. So let's upgrade this guy to 4.0. And let's see just how many of these Boss Toilets we can kill with this guy. Well, he can barely even kill these giant glasses toilets and these vacuum toilets. That's for sure. The, the vacuum toilets have a lot of health, okay? That's just how it is, sadly. Look, I'm killing them eventually. It's just taking me a little, a little moment. That's all. Bro, by the time these toilets even die, these giant glasses toilets are gonna be 
of his ring. Uh, well, you know what? Let me just uh, let me just let me just spawn in a boss toilet 4.0 right now, so that it doesn't get uh, washed away by the other toilets. And now the game is getting good. Let's see if this boss toilet 4.0 can survive. And Pip, I'm just telling you right now, I cannot, bro. We are gonna destroy this thing. Come on, the boss toilet unit does 120,000 damage, and I just realized I'm still reading it. And I, the boss toilet 4.0 almost died while I was just reading that. Yeah, look, man, huh? bro. This guy is losing all his health. I think we might actually have to see how many waves of this boss toilet we can survive instead of just how many of the boss toilet we can survive. If you get what I mean, I'm sending these boss toilet 4.0s on wave 30. So maybe we should try and send one on wave 50 instead. Pip, we're gonna have to uh, really try and kill this boss toilet over here first. Um, we're in a bit of a pickle here, I'll be honest. Oh, little Louie don't know how to open the pickle jar. No, I'm just trying to get rid of these toilets, bro. They're all surrounding him. He's got a human shield. This isn't fair. I, I can't believe you're really about to die. Do you need a help from a duck? Bro, how are we supposed to 1v1 these guys if they are using human shields? It's, it's not fair. It's a sacrifice I'm not willing to make. Let me get rid of this guy, bro. Okay, there we go. Look, we, we managed to kill the boss toilet 4.0. That was super easy. Okay, only took you forever. Come on, the real boss toilet 4.0 is over here, and you aren't killing him. Yeah, this guy is a wave 50 menace, bro. If he manages to get through, then I would not be able to beat wave 50 with this guy. I think I can. I think I can. Boss toilet 4.0, you are making me so proud. All right, well, Pip, this guy has 50% of his health, and he's 50% of the way through my... My, um, my little map here, but I think we should be fine, actually. I think we'll, I think we'll be okay. It's kind of a shame because there's, there's, there's these forklift toilets trying to get in the way, bro. They're trying to, they're trying to steal my thunder. No, you're not allowed, bro. You're not allowed, little bro. This is the last breath of this boss toilet. If he can get through, then it will be able to beat a boss toilet. We'll see. Can we beat wave 50 with a single boss toilet? Can the boss toilet die to the boss toilet on wave 50? I'm pretty sure it will die. It's neck and neck. Oh! Oh, what did I say, Pip? What did I say, Pip? What did I say? I said we could do it, and what did we do? We did it. We did it. We did it. Okay, you were an inch away from losing, Louie. You shouldn't go around flexing. Nope, I was not an inch away from losing. I was an inch away from winning. Bro, well, Louie, spawn a real boss, and then maybe we will actually see if he struggles. All right, Pip, fine. Okay, let's spawn a boss toilet, but not just any one boss toilet. We're gonna spawn one on wave 100. Uh, okay, I, maybe I shouldn't have done that, Pip. This guy has 44 million health. <laughs> Okay, yeah, Louis, you might as well get the butter, because you are toast. You know what? It's going to take a boss toilet army to take out this guy, but I'm going to do it. Pip, I believe in myself. I'm just going to keep putting boss toilets down, and I'm going to kill this guy. I know it. So let me just keep upgrading, and yeah, Pip, this guy is dying quickly, bro. He's on 55% of his health, and he's going down quick. Any other toilets that try to interfere with this 1v1 die instantly, just like these little DJ cat toilets, bro. They're dead. It's on 15%. It's on 10%. Just like that, it is dead. I just knew we could do it. But Pip, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to spawn a whole army of boss toilets. I'm gonna spawn more than I've ever placed in an entire game by myself. I'm gonna put down like one. I'm gonna put two. I'm gonna put three. I'm literally gonna fill the map completely full with them in the middle here. And then I'm gonna spawn a boss toilet on wave 300. And then I'm gonna keep going up and up and up and up. You're going to die eventually. You might as well not even try. Well, we'll see about that, Pip. I'm spawning a boss toilet right now. And this thing is not going to be wave 100. It's going to be wave 200. Boom. And Okay, Pip. This thing, yeah, this thing is going to kill me. This thing is going to kill me. It has 630,000. No, no, not 1,000. Million health. If this thing beats us, I'm, I'm still not giving you that Robux, bro. This is, this is literally further than any player in toilet tower defense has ever gone. Anyways, Pip, I'm going to be completely huh? honest with you. I do not think we're killing this boss toilet. We have definitely put up a fight, though. This guy has... Has, uh, not that much health left. So, Louis, you can send 1,000 Robux to totally not Pip YT? <laughs> Bro, I'm not sending you Robux. Yeah, I'm not sending you Robux. I literally, like, no one can get this far. There's no way someone can get a boss toilet 4.0 with 600 million health in their game. Come on. Let me just help you out since you're so bad. I'm just going to place down some boss toilets and let's see if, what is this, 40 boss toilets can take down that one boss toilet 2.0. Oh. 
honestly, I don't think it can, Pip. We haven't even bumped this boss toilet down to 50% health yet. He is still holding strong. Come on, partner. We need to take down this boss toilet 4.0. We need to give him a beat and we need to show him who his maker is. Yeah, bro, but it's not going to be that easy because the boss toilet has too much health. He's been drinking too much root beer. What in rootin' tootin' cowboy tarnation is going on here? What in the skibbity? Um, what the sigma? Uh, Pip, cowboys do not say what the sigma, but they do say what the skibbity. What the Indiana Jones is Okay, <laughs> okay, Pip, that's a, a little too skibbity for me. Anyways, uh, I'm pretty sure we lost because this boss toilet is literally oh. unkillable. It's gonna kill us, Pip, and I think we're gonna take a lot more than 400 damage. Oh, no! Looks like I just made a thousand robots. Oh, no, you did not. Louis, you're totally cheating. Okay, fine. You know what, Pip? I'll give you that Robux. Come back to the lobby. I'll pass it over to you. All right, Pip. We're back in the lobby now. And uh, honestly, okay, you can have your Robux. L listen, I'm going to send it to you, right? Three, two, one, now. I'm playing infinite units so I control my best friend. I just made a noob account so he has no idea this is me. All right, guys. So I'm pretty sure Pip is in this lobby. Look, he's over there. And the best part is I have the game pass that gives me infinite units, which is this one right here. And it only lasts until like 2 p.m. today. So I've got to really hurry on this one. So what I'm going to do is follow him into a game and then troll him by placing infinite units. First of all, though, I need to make sure I have some pretty good units, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some Santas, because I love them. I'm gonna get my green lasers just to help me out, or actually, I can only place a certain amount of green lasers, so I guess I can let Pip do all the work there. And I'm gonna get a bunch of cheap units and place them down, because I'll have infinite of them. You know what? Maybe I should go with a ton of Titan Drill Man. I'll get a few cheap ones, like some leprechauns and some elf camera women. And you know what? Just to troll Pip, I'm gonna get a ton of Speaker Man. All right, this seems good enough. Let's go follow Pip. Wait, where did he go? Louie! Oh, finally. A day to play Toilet Tower Defense without Louie. Oh, I really feel like playing the Egg Island. All right, guys, look, there's only 10 seconds left. So I've got to sneak into his game as soon as it gets to two. Or oh, three, two, one, 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 go, 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 go. All right, I think I got in. Wait a second. Did someone join my game? Uh-oh. I think Pip is on to me. Don't worry, guys. It's fine. I'll just put down my Santa right there. And I'll keep going ahead and placing down units. Eventually, he'll find me, though. Wait a second. Did I just place down two Santas? It, it says I've only placed down one unit. Uh-oh. Uh, the toilets are getting through as well. I'm gonna place down an elf camera woman. And guys, look at this. I have infinite units. It says two out of infinity, so I can place down as many as I want. Uh, let me just place down another Santa. And... Wait, there's four Santas? Oh, I can't place down four Santas. That must mean someone else joined me in my game. Uh oh, guys. Uh, I think Pim's on to me. I think Pim's on to me. Where is he? Wait, there's a bacon over there. Oh, come back here, bacon hair. I can't let Pip know I'm here. I need to sneak. I need to sneak. Get on the tree. Get on the tree. Yeah. Wait. There's a little dude trying to climb that tree. Uh, no, that's not. No, that's not. Uh, that's not me. That's not me. This dumb noob joined my lobby, and now all the police toilets are going to get to the end. Oh, that, that's actually not good. Guys, you know what? I'm gonna save the day. Let me just place down another elf and another elf. Boom. That should deal with these police toilets just fine. This bacon hair noob has elf camera women. Oh, wait. That's like the worst unit in the game. That, that's worse than the basic speaker man. Oh. What? Did Pip just say my elf camera women were trash? He's going to regret that in a moment. But you know what? I'm going to tell him. I'll just say I'm a developer. And you'll regret what you said. He said, I'm a developer and you'll regret what you said. What do you mean I'll regret what I said? <laughs> what do you mean I'll regret what I said? 
That I said exactly what I said, buddy. That means I'm gonna get absolutely crazy. And you are going to pee yourself when you find out I can place down as many units as I want. Just you wait, guys. When it gets to about wave 10, I'll have enough money from these Santas to spawn as many units as I please. I just need to get there first. These elf camera women are kind of trash. I just need to make sure there's at least one that does all of the dirty work. And you know what? I can skip right here and put down a leprechaun. This guy should be able to deal with all of those toilets just for now. Wait, guys, wouldn't it be funny if I just placed down like infinite leprechauns? You know what? I'm doing that. I just need to get enough money first, though. This might be difficult, but it's easily doable for me. Look, I can put down one here and then one right here. I just need to squeeze him in. He's very difficult to place down. I'll put him right there. Look, I've got two leprechauns now. I'm gonna upgrade my next Santa like this. And then if we skip the wave, I should be able to place down two more. Wait, this noob actually has good units. Oh, he has a bunch of leprechauns. Um, wait, did Pip just say I have good units? Does he finally think I'm good at the game? You know what? I'm gonna tell him. I'll say, bro, you think I'm trash? Of course I do. You're a bacon hair after all. Well, not only does Pip think I'm a noob, Bruh. he's also discriminating against me because I have bacon hair. You guys should never do that. Never judge a book by its cover. You know what? Just to troll Pip a little bit more, let me just keep putting down these leprechauns. So I'll put one right here, and then I'll put one right here, and then I'll put one right here. You know, you know the drill, guys. I'll just place down as many leprechauns as my heart desires. I'm gonna literally make it look like there's grass growing in the Easter Island. It's going to be crazy. And also, while I'm at it, I need to keep upgrading my Santas. For every single Santa I have, I can place down another one of these leprechauns, which means I can make a big wall of leprechaun death. But you know, guys, these leprechauns are pretty pretty good, but I also have these Titan Drill Men. Maybe I should place down infinites of them. That would be hilarious. Oh, all this noob is doing is placing down leprechauns. Oh, he really is a noob. He should know that leprechauns are trash. What? What did Pip just say? You know what? I think for Pip, bigger is better. So how about I go ahead and put down my Drill Men now? Let me just squeeze them into all of the places I can. So I'll do, let's see, I could put a drill man right here in the water, then I'll put one right here on this bridge, then I'm going to put another one right here, and another one right here in the middle too. Look, I've got four Titan drill men! I'm already at 20 units! How does this noob have so many Titan drill men put down? Wait, guys, I think Pip is finally noticing that I'm placing down a ton of units! You know what? I'm gonna put down a drill man every single time I possibly can. Let's put another one here. And then let's put another one right behind this guy here. And then another one right in the middle. <laughs> Look how many drills there are! Why am I in a forest of Titan drill men? Oh my gosh. Pip is getting so confused right now. You know what? Maybe I can pretend I'm a developer and he'll believe me. You know what? Let me actually do that right now. I'm gonna tell him I'm a developer. Do you believe believe me now? I'm a developer. Do you believe me now? Oh, I never believe bacon hairs. Well, maybe he should stop believing bacon hairs now, guys, because I don't know about this. It's crazy. There's no way this noob can place down so many units. You can only place down 15. <gasps> Wait, maybe he's secretly telanthric and he's working on a new update where you can place more units. Um, are you secretly Talanthric? Wait, let me see here. Are you secretly Talanthric? Um, no, I'm not Talanthric. But I am able to pretend I am. Let me just say that. Here we go. I'll say, duh, I have infinite units, and these drills are crazy. Wait, he said, duh, I have infinite units, and these drills are crazy. How does he have infinite units? That's impossible! Unless this is an April Fool's joke pulled by the developer. The developers love me. How is this guy placing so many drill men? Well, we should count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18
no, Pip, there isn't a thousand drillmen, but there's like a billion of them! This is, no, this is crazy, guys. I'm sorry. This is, this is absolutely insane. I've got 40 units placed down right now, and I don't think there's anywhere else you could place units at all right now. Bruh. How am I going to place any of my units if this noob keeps placing his units everywhere? Wait. Maybe he isn't actually a noob, because if he can place down so many units, maybe he's better than me. But that's not possible. Wait, guys, there's actually no way. I think Pip is starting to believe that noobs are better than him at toilet tower defense. This is absolutely crazy. There's no way that Pip thinks he's worse than a noob right now. Why is he placing drillmen over here? This is literally useless. Look at their range. They can't even hit anywhere near where the toilets are. Guys, I have to be honest. Pip is kind of right there. But it's insane. Isn't it just funny that I can place down units? It's literally wherever I want, even in these trash spots. I don't even have to worry about running out of units. I'll just put one right here, and then I'll put one right... Uh, let me see if I can squeeze one in here. No, I can't. Uh, let me put one here. And then I'll put one here, and then here, and then here. Yeah, I'm just filling up the map with these drills. There is nothing Pip will be able to do. This noob doesn't stop placing Titan Drillman. I need to tell him to stop placing Titan Drill men, you noob. Bah, 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 bah. Oh, wait, Pip said something. Um, stop placing Titan drill men, you noob. What? Uh, but a drill man is literally OP. How could I stop? This noob isn't listening to me. He's still placing down a hundred Titan drill men. This guy is so annoying. I just want to play by myself. Guys, Pip is getting so angry right now. I am just placing down all the drillmen I want. And apparently, this is good enough to make Pip angry. What? You know what? Just to annoy him, I'm going to place down one in every single possible spot in the map. So that he can't place down any more units. It'll be hilarious. I can't place down my leprechaun anywhere. I guess I'll have to go to the back of the map. Like, uh, over here next to the end. Guys, look at this. Pip is going to place down his units right here at the end. But I'm going to fill it up with these useless speaker men. <laughs> Wait. Noob, stop placing speaker men. Those are useless. Place those tight drill men again. They're way better. <laughs> Guys, Pip is getting so annoyed. Look, he only got to place one leprechaun down. And I'm just filling the map with these speaker men. He's gonna get so angry. Gosh, I can't even place down another leprechaun. I guess I can place them over here. Well, he's gonna try to place them in the middle. Nah, -uh. I'm gonna place more speaker men. Get Troll Pip! <laughs> Why is he placing speaker men again? Oh my gosh, this is the worst noob I've ever met! <laughs> I absolutely love placing speaker man. This is my favorite thing in the game. Bow, 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 bow. Ooh, this guy is even more annoying than my best friend Louie. Uh, Wait, what? What did you say? I don't really even see around the map. There's just so many Titan drill men. I need to place my leprechaun somewhere. Uh, maybe over here. Oh, Pip is trying to get far, far away from me. Uh, but little does he know, I'm just gonna fill up all of the possible spaces he can put the leprechaun. Leprechauns. Oh, with these speaker men. Boom, 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 boom. He's gonna be so mad. He's still placing these speaker men. Oh, let me just place the leprechauns before he can place the speaker men down. Oh, guys, I need to take up more space faster. I'll just put drills down. He can't place anything next to them. There we go. There we go. Let's put another one right here so he can't fill up the gaps. Uh, let me put one out here. And then I'll put one here. And then I'll fill up the middle sections with these speaker men, just like this. And you know what? I could probably fill up some gaps with these elf camera women. This way, he'll think there's more leprechauns going down because they're all green. So I'll just place a ton more of these elves, as many as I can. Wait, it looks like the noob is actually placing down good units. He placed a bunch of 
leprechauns around my leprechauns. Oh, maybe this noob isn't a noob after all. <laughs> Guys, Pip just thought I was placing down more leprechauns. But look, you can tell the difference. These are elf camera women, and this guy's a leprechaun. They look nothing alike. But you know what? Whatever floats Pip's boat, I guess. Let me just upgrade some more of these Titan Drillmen to max, just so that nothing else can get through. I'm gonna have so much money by the end of this. Look how many units there are. Oh my gosh, this isn't even Egg Island anymore. This is Titan Drillman Island. Yeah, you know what? Pip actually is right there. This is Titan Drillman Island. You know what? Just to annoy Pip, I'm just gonna keep putting down Speaker Man after Speaker Man after Speaker Man. I'm gonna fill up every single space in this entire map with Speaker Man. And Pip is going to be absolutely so sad. Guys, you know how I placed down like 40 units before? Well, it's not anymore. It's 175 units on one map. Oh, and why is this new placing down a bunch of speaker men? Noob, what are you doing? Um, Pip just said, what are you doing? Guys, I know what he's saying. He just asked me, what am I doing? But I am going to just very clearly say, playing the game. <laughs> Playing the game? Oh, why is this noob gotta be so annoying? Oh, I I'm gonna ask, why are you trolling me? Uh, why are you trolling me? You know what? I'm gonna tell him something that's gonna make him really annoyed. I'm not trolling you, comma. I'm carrying you! And then I'll call him Pip the Pip Squeak. Bom, bom, bom. Squeak. Ah! I said, I'm not trolling you. I'm carrying you, Pip the Pip Squeak. Oh, how did he read that? I put Pip Squeakle. No, you're not carrying me, noob. You're placing down a bunch of trash units. Wait, what? He's saying I'm placing down a bunch of trash units? Uh, I don't know about you guys, but um, is Drillman trash? I don't think so. Well, you should know that Titan Drillman is absolutely useless. What did Pip just say? I should know that Titan Drillman is useless? No, it's not. Uh, guys, do you think Titan Drillman is absolutely useless? Uh, comment down below. And if you could place down this many units, what unit would you place down? Let me know in the comments below. Because I might just try that next. Well... Luckily, this unit is way better than Titan Drill Man. What? Did Pip just place down a green laser cameraman? These things are trash compared to the drill. The only thing they do is slow them down. You know what, guys? If you think the Titan Drill Man is better than the green laser, like the video because clearly you are very, very good at this game. And I want more people like you watching the videos. And if you want to see more videos like this where I placed down about a billion units on the map, then make sure to subscribe to become a Louis legend. Because I do videos like this every single day. Which means you guys get a fix of your daily content every single day. So make sure you subscribe. But anyways, enough of that. It's time for me to place down more drills. If I even can. There's like no space left on the map. And I'm lagging so bad. Look how bad I'm lagging. Wait, wait a second. What just happened? I lost? Oh, how did you just lose with a thousand Titan Drillmen placed down? Oh, no, guys. It must have been a glitch toilet. It must have been a glitch toilet. Are you kidding me? Oh, guys, that didn't go well at all. We lost somehow. But you know what? I have an even better strategy. All right, let me go ahead and get the Santas. And this time, I am going to get a bunch of these camera spiders and a bunch of these speaker spiders. Since they can walk around all over the place, I could place down about infinite of them. I guess I can also try and place down infinite green lasers. And just in case that doesn't work, you know what? I'm getting a bunch of mewing TV men because mewing is just what I do. Can you guys see my jaw? It's beautiful. Look, I even have the cheekbones. Y you know what? Well, whatever. I'm gonna have to troll Pip once again. So I need to wait for him to go back into another game. But wait a second. Guys, I just had a really good idea. Instead of using the these speaker spiders like this. Maybe I should use the upgraded camera spider. This thing would be insane. All right, this should be beautiful. All right, and I'm back in the lobby, and where did that noob go? Oh, that must mean he's gone. Thank goodness. Uh oh, he's looking for me. He's looking for me. It's time to play an action. 
actual solo game of Egg Island. Uh, All right, there he goes once again. Back to Egg Island like he does. You know what? He's looking over there, so I'm going to go around the back. But I gotta hurry! I got 10 seconds left! Go, 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 go. And I'm gonna do what I usually do, where I go over here under the tree. And then three, two, one! Run, 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 run. Hello! Wait, is that noob here again? Oh, no. I think he saw me this time. Uh, oh, no! Uh, you know what? I just need to keep going. Put my sadness down quick. This noob, how did he even get here? Um, don't even ask. Don't even ask. I'm just OP <laughs> like that. You know what? I'm going to tell him something. I'm even stronger. I'm even stronger this time. I'm goated. Yeah, he's going to believe that soon. Even stronger this time? I'm goaded? Well, I didn't see him open up any crates, so he can't be much stronger. Oh, yeah. I am much stronger, and Pip does not know that. Oh, by the way, guys, I sneaked into his Discord call, and I am muted. So he can't hear what I'm saying, but I can hear what he's saying. And this isn't good, guys. The toilets are kind of, kind of, kind of getting through, you know? It's fine, though. I gotta keep putting down Santa's. Well, the noob has a green laser. Uh, I guess he actually learned what a good unit is. All right, guys, this is good. Pip thinks I'm actually kind of OP right now, but... What's not good is all the toilets are getting through. Pip isn't helping me. Why is this noob letting us lose? I thought we were going to win this time. Oh, uh, I ain't letting us lose. I'm just struggling because you ain't helping me, buddy. Oh, you know what? I'm going to tell him that. Help! 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 Wait, help? I thought you had infinite units. Who oh, just help me? Looks like I'm going to lose if I don't help this noob. Help, help. So I guess I'll place down a green laser. That should help. What? There's absolutely no way Pip just said he was carrying me. <laughs> you know what? I don't care. Because I'm about to place down the first upgraded camera spider. I just need to get a little bit more money and I'll be good to go. All right, here we go. Let's put one down right here and boom. This guy's going to do some pretty insane damage. Look, he can jump on things and... Wait a second. Did he just fall in the water? What, what just happened? You know what? It doesn't matter because I'm about to place down another camera spider right here. Whoa. Look, there's two of them right now and they're just jumping all over these guys. Wait a second. What is going on? How did this noob get in an exclusive unit? Um, there is no way Pip doesn't think I'm goated right now. Y you know what? I'm going to tell him. I'm OP. That's why I have Robux. Huh. If you have Robux, why do you have a bacon here? Do, do, do. There we go. More camera spiders and... Wait. If you, if you have Robux, why do you have bacon hair? Oh, oh no. I need to come up with an excuse. Uh, my mom only gave me one dollar. There we go. That, that should, that should do fine. Wait, my mom only gave me one dollar? But one dollar isn't going to buy the upgraded camera spider. Uh, yeah, duh. It, it, obviously it will. Well, I think it's time to teach this noob a lesson. Wait, what is Pip saying? What did Pip just say? You should sell all of your units and just let... Let me carry you. What? There is no way. Pip just told me that I should let him carry him. Guys, do you think that's even a good idea? I don't think I'd let Pip carry me, like, even once. But you know what? I guess if I have to do it to troll Pip, I'll do it. So, fine. I'll just tell him you can carry me. You can carry me. He said I can carry him. Let's go. Really be excited. I've been carrying him this whole time. I guess while Pip's doing that, though, guys, I need to place as many of these upgraded camera spiders as I can. I need like a billion of them. Uh. Go, 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 go. I need an army. Attack! Let me just wait until I got some money and then boop, there's another one. And look at this, guys. What is that supposed to be? It, it looks terrifying. There's so many of them. They're all perched right here. You know what? I could probably put another one here if I'm really careful. And squeeze it in. Boom. There's another one. And then boom. There's another one. And then boom. There's so many of them. This is hilarious. 
I don't think I've ever seen so many of these upgraded camera spiders in my entire life. And the best part is, they all just bunch up here and chase down the toilets. They're so strong. And you know what? I think I'm gonna upgrade one of them to max once I got all that money money. So let's just get some extra income from my Santas. And then let's go ahead and upgrade one of these camera spiders as much as we can. Boom, boom, boom. I have a few more upgrades to upgrade this guy with. And then we will be going crazy. I'm giving these camera spiders insane range as well. It's OP. Boop. There we go. I have one on level four now. Just look at the damage I'm doing. It's insane. And on the next upgrade, I should be able to get some more of this explosion radius, which means I can damage multiple toilets at once. It's gonna be kind of good, guys. So let's go ahead and just wait a second for the next skip. Boom. And I need to find out where this camera spider goes. It seems like he goes around about over here. And wait, I just saw a bunch of them falling from the sky. But what's going on? Are they raining from the sky now? All right, guys, it's fine. All I've got to do is just wait until I can upgrade this one. And we will be set. And nothing will be able to stop us at all. It's kind of funny, though, watching these upgraded camera spiders. When they fall in the water, they just disappear and then fly all the way down from the sky. It's kind of scary. Come on, though. If I get a little bit more money, I can upgrade this guy and he will be maxed out. It'll be insane. And then after that, I can place down a ton more of them. Right now, I only have 20 four of these, but once I upgrade this guy, he's gonna be OP. Let's see this guy in action. And yeah, I gotta admit, guys, this is kinda strong. It does so much damage. What? It's literally a splash unit right now. You know what? I think I have a good idea, guys. I am going to put down a ton of these camera spiders, and then I'm going to max out a ton more of them. So let's go ahead and get all these guys down. Boom, there's another one. Boom, there's another one. I'm literally just going to have, like, a spider colony that jumps onto the toilets when I want them to. Just look at that. You can't even see the toilets anymore. There's that many of them. And then when I'm ready and need to do more damage, I can go ahead and place down a absolute boatload more of them. So let's just put down some more of those. And yeah, this is looking kind of insane. It's actually starting to lag my game a little bit too, which is actually kind of scary. But look at that. Look how many there are. And then whenever they detect a toilet, they just absolutely attack. They jump on them, beat them up, and that is it for them. And you know what? Just to help my toilets a little bit, I'll put down a green laser to slow some things down. There we go. This is looking insane now. We are doing like a billion DPS. Wait, why is this noob going low-key crazy? He put down so many spiders, and now there's like a forest of spiders. Oh, this is so scary. Wait, no way. Did Pip just say he's scared of Spiders? I'm scared of spiders too! If you guys are scared of spiders, then, um... Subscribe. Subscribe. But now that I think about it, guys, if I upgrade some more of these camera spiders, I should be able to make this OP. Because one of them is doing a ton of splash damage right now, and that's already kind of OP. If I can get another one of them doing splash, we will be unstoppable! I just need to get rid of these giant blind toilets, but these camera spiders are a little bit, um, what should I say? Mid! It's fine, though! As long as I keep upgrading my senses, we are set. I'll be able to make a ton more of these really strong spiders, and we'll be okay. I mean, just look at the damage we are pumping out right now. It's basically unstoppable. I'm gonna upgrade this camera spider right in the middle here now. I'm gonna make him OP. I just need to make sure to remember where he is because uh, I can't really find him in all of these spiders. Oh, well, the last time this new placed down a bunch of units, we lost. So I'm going to place down a bunch of units over here and I'm actually going to put down OP units unlike this new. I'm placing down a bunch of green lasers and a bunch of leprechauns. So maybe if any of those glitch toilets come through, they'll get demolished. Wait, did Pip just say my units were trash? Well, um, not anymore. I just got another level 5 upgraded camera spider. This is crazy. And I'm just starting now on upgrading another one. I think I'll start by upgrading one of them that's very close to this middle area. So I'll do this one. Boom. Skip the wave. Boom. 
this guy's level four now. There is no stopping me now, buddy. Wait, but one of my camera spiders are flying away. What are they doing? They're flying away. What the heck was that? Yo, this noob stinks so much that these camera spiders don't even like him. Look at what camera spiders are hiding over here. Uh, I'm gonna say, what did you say? Did you say? Wait, he said, what did you say? How did he know I just insulted his camera spiders? Oh, uh oh. Guys, I really shouldn't be saying things. If Pip says anything in the voice chat and I say it, I might not be undercover as a noob anymore. Uh, that's not good. Uh, I'm going to ask him. How did you know I insulted your camera spiders? Oh, uh oh. How did you know I insulted your camera spiders? Uh, guys, what do I say? What do I say? Um, he's gonna know that I'm in the voice channel, and then he'll know it's me. Um, uh, you know what? I got an idea. I'll just say, because I'm actually Talantric. He said, because I'm actually Talantric? Oh, well, the real Talantric would know how to spell his name. Besides, Talantric isn't even thick. What? <laughs> you know what, guys? Uh, Pip is being really weird right now. There's no way he just said Talantric is thick. But you know who is thick? Me! Because I have an awesome twerking dance. Watch this. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, oh no. Uh, I said that in the chat. Uh, uh, go, go, go. Do the twerk. Boom. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Why is this noob twerking? He acts like he's carrying me when I'm secretly carrying him. What is this guy even saying? A pip isn't carrying me at all. Bruh. He wishes he could carry me with all of my upgraded spiders. You know what? I haven't placed down enough yet. Let me place down more. Boom, on there. I'm gonna keep placing them down until I have a hundred of them. And then there is no way Pip can say that I'm trash anymore. Let's just go ahead and put down a billion of them. I'll just spawn them in absolutely everywhere. And then we will have a spider squad or a spider gang. What should I call it, guys? I guess the more camera spiders I place down, the more crazy this is going to get because I might actually lag the game out with so many moving units. Bruh. Look. There, I've placed out so many of them that they're moving so slow now. I'm lagging the game. This is crazy. You would think that Talantric would make this game less likely to lag, but he doesn't. All right, I'm going to place some more camera spiders. One there. And, wait, that guy just fell into the water. Wait, they're jumping into the water and dying. Look. Why are they doing that? Let me just put another one down. And wait, come back. Oh, my gosh. These, these cameras, man. Wait, he's trying to get back, but he can't swim. Look, he, he's trying and then he, he slips right back into the water. That's so sad. Wait, what's going on? Look, th the cameras over here aren't even moving. They're just watching. Oh, are you joking me? I think I've lagged the game really bad, guys. These camera spiders can't even move anymore, so they're useless. There's actually no way this is happening right now. There's actually no way. Come on, spiders, do something. Oh, no. This this is really bad, guys. Um, I wasn't expecting them to be this bad when you placed down so many of them. I think I might have broke the game. Look, there's one swimming down there. Wait, why is this noob's unit not doing any damage to the toilets? Oh, no. Guys, I think it's time for plan B. I need to put down some mewing TV men right after I upgrade this last upgraded spider. Boom. There we go. Okay, mewing time. I don't think these camera spiders are very good. So I'm going to have to put down as much mewing as possible so that I can stop these toilets. Go! I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. It seems like it's really difficult right now. These boss toilets are getting through. No, 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 no. I got to admit, guys, my camera spiders can't even catch the toilets anymore. This is uh, kind of bad for me. Oh my gosh, we're about to lose because this new camera spiders are doing absolutely nothing. What is Pip saying? I'm doing just fine, but um, I guess it's not my fault that we're losing. All right, I'll put down one more green laser and uh, yeah, I think we lost. No way! I would have won if it wasn't for that noob. All right, I'm going back to the lobby. I've got to tell Pip it's really me. All right, guys, I'm back in the lobby and now it's time to tell Pip that it's really his best friend, Louie, who's been trolling him this whole time. Let me just go to him and tell him. Back in the lobby and... Wait, why did this noob rejoin my server? Let me just tell him. Do you know me? No, who is me? Oh, uh, maybe I need to be more specific. Do you know your best friend, Louie? Do you know your 
best friend Louie? Oh, uh, I don't like to say Louie is my best friend, so I'll just say my best friend is Dewey. What is this guy talking about, Dewey? Oh my god. You know what, guys? That's it. That's it. I'm just gonna reveal myself right now. Oh, look at me, Pip. I'm gonna straight up reset right now. Boom. And hopefully, I'll be me. What is he talking about? Hello, Pip. Uh, hey, Louie. Uh, uh, glad you could join me in my private server. Um, Pip, I'm sorry to say this, but I've been here this whole time. Oh, you've been in here? Oh, no, you haven't. It's just been me and that noob. Uh-huh, that noob, huh? Well, um, do you want to learn a secret? Look at my inventory. I've been this noob the whole time! Wait, you've, you've been the noob playing with me and carrying me? Yep, and you were trash, Pip. Boom, you were trash. You were trash, and I was so good, I got a rash. I, I, I didn't need to know that, Louie. Oh, all right, stop listening, stop listening. But uh, anyways, I absolutely totally trolled you, Pip, and you were not expecting a thing. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, then make sure to like, subscribe, and click the next video on your screen. Let's go!